Yeah. Mm. Uh. Hey, welcome back. Uh. Hi. Um, hi, welcome back. Um, we're gonna be doing more Twilight Princess today. Oh wow, that's that's real loud, ain't it? Uh, there we go. Yeah, hi. Uh, uh we're back. We're gonna do the uh what's it fucking called the mansion i forgot the name of it i never forget the or never remember the name of the freaking dungeons in this game i know the name of like like the first ones i just call like forest and fire and water temple because that's basically what they are right um anything after that i always forget like arbiter's grounds how am i supposed to remember that um last time we ended right when we got the um fall on chain which is the next major item that we need to move on, so we're gonna move on and do the dungeon because we're just seems like we're just doing them in order, I guess. So that's what we're gonna do. Um in between streams. Actually I think this was before last stream and I just forgot to call it out. Uh thank you, SVM. Otherwise known as mute. Hello. Um, thank you for following. Okay. It, why is it still so loud? Is that loud for you guys too? And it's not as loud as my voice, but like, still real loud. Um, anyway, before we get to the, the ice dungeon, we do have some, uh, <laughs> some, some good, good snowboarding to do, which is arguably probably the most fun minigame in Zelda games. Oh, whoa, oh, still gonna turn it down just a little bit, just in my ears. There we go. Turn it back up for you guys. Okay. I heard ruckus and oh, just a human. I see humans not often, huh? Why humans come to snows? You on spiritual journey? You look for true self? Uh, that's pretty fucking deep. I guess so. <laughs> oh, 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 oh! You look for a long time. Hmm. That was joke. Yet he's joke too. Uh. You look for something else, uh? Tell truth. Uh, yeah, I know. Looking for how to get that sweet princess. Uh, you look for a mirror in such far away place. Oh, 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 why you not say so before? But you make good climb, and you lucky to meet me. You found shiny mirror piece. Same mirror you look for, uh? Uh, why do? You okay, here's what I want to know: is why do you have a saddle on your head? Is that? I'm not gonna be riding you. Uh, you come to a house and see yourself. I caught fish. I make you hot meal at least. My house far away. We slide there. Oh, do like me. Come up. <laughs> Just fucking punch that tree in the face. Like, yeah, fuck you, tree. <laughs> Look at him go. Yeah. Okay, it is a hat. Okay, it's not just part of his head. I, you know, at first I thought it was actually part of his head. Um. Yeah, let's do it. See, I will say, Breath of the Wild Link is a bit more of a chad in this situation, because he would have just used his shield. Let's go! And yeet! Yeah! Look at this. Fucking 1080 snowboarding. Drifting! Yeah! This part is so... Oh, Jesus. This is what solidifies Link as an absolute chad for me. Just like, the fact that he's able to do this and pull out his sword. Just fucking massacring enemies on the way down. On fucking snowboard. What an absolute chad. Oh, hi, mute. Oh, no, my chat's broken. Uh, I can't see chat because it's behind me. I, I just move out of the way. Never seen something. <laughs> I have to fix it when I get out of this. Or actually, can I pause? Yeah, I can pause. Hi, mute. How is it going? Um, ba, 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 ba. I'm just gonna really quickly fix chat. Never seen this part of Twilight Princess. It's uh, relatively late in the game, I think. It's. I mean, we are pretty late into the game now, I guess. So, Does this work. Uh, it's. I'm still covering part of it. Maybe a little bit less. 
like a like a 1250 situation yeah that looks about right in the car currently on the way back oh gotcha yeah because you're moving today that's right how's how's it going so far doing okay i'm able to move everything are you going to be taking multiple trips i assume you probably have to right Unless you're able to pack everything into the car. I haven't done a big move since I moved back from my apartment a couple years ago. Um, but I know that it's a fucking ordeal. Yeah, good luck. Hopefully the new place is better. I would hope. Ooh, this and... Oh, fuck! No! <laughs> Damn it. I wasn't paying attention. I was having too much fun. No, really, they're gonna pick me all the way back at the top. God. God damn it. Okay. That's fine. We need to get the snowboard some more, I guess. Don't have a lot of my own stuff like furniture. Oh, yeah. Because you're moving in with someone, right? So there's. It's, it's like a set, like. Home, like you have a room and stuff. Like that part's kind of kind of nice, right? Like the furniture should already be there then in that case. Oh yo, Link running on the tops of trees like a badass. Being it out, yeah, no problem. Yeah, feel free to hang it. Oh no, I'm sorry. Oh no, Link, I'm sorry. Yeah, feel free to hop in or out. Or just lurk. I don't mind either way. Happy to see you here, though. Yeah, we are most of the way through this game. Considering that we've been going in the dungeons in vanilla order, even though this is a randomizer. Just back home. Gotcha. I have to... I didn't put the chat high enough. I have to actually move my head to see you. I know, right? That was sick. Link's a badass. Yeah, do a backflip and everything. I do want to know how the Yeti got through this door, though. That... My immersion is ruined. There's no way the Yeti could get through that door. Snow Peak, that's the name of this place. I don't know why I forgot. Um... Okay, I guess right away we can just fucking... Uh, maybe keep this... Yeah, right away we can just take care of this. Because we have the item already. This is what I was hoping for. It was I was hoping we'd just be able to kind of get all the items in here without having to come back to get the item. Or get the, the key item from here. There's got to be something in one of these, right? I thought there was. Oh, it's behind. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Okay, let's just take care of you real quick. Yeah, is it not? Ah. Got it. Have to demolish them first, okay. Very carefully, yeah. This dungeon is an interesting one. I I really like the fact that it's uh it has a different setting to most other temples and dungeons and stuff. Like it's literally just a mansion. We're, we are essentially playing Luigi's mansion right now. Actually, I will say all the, all the dungeons. Uh oh, uh oh, that's that's not okay. All of the dungeons in this game are really really solid. This game has some really good ones. Get out of here! In your heart. Your name was uh, George. I think I already gave it to George. Or there was a George before, I think. We're at forty. Hey, Kev. We're... you're... You, you didn't miss much, we just got down the mountain after some snowboarding. Oh, there's another guy too? There are more pros in here than I remember. Get back down here. Your name is, uh... Sarah. Sarah is being a little bitch running away from me right now. There we go. Sarah died in a tragic car accident. No, actually, I don't think that's the case. I think she died. Oh, they actually give you those key items? I didn't know. 
No, Sarah died, um, not in a car accident. She was crossing the road and bent down to tie her shoelace. And she wasn't hit by a car. She was actually hit by a, uh, a, uh, a, a stray... I don't know where I'm going with this. Never mind, I give up. I give up trying to give, like, meaningful deaths to the, all the ghosts in this game. I didn't know that the post could actually give you the, the dungeon items, that's kind of neat. It means I have to be on the lookout for them. Hey, what do you say? Want to help, yeah. Okay, we're not gonna do the whole rigmarole? You're not gonna make me run around? I guess that wouldn't really make sense. Make me go do the fetch quest for all the items, if they're just gonna give me them. Oh god, I gotta sneeze. I gotta sneeze. Nope, never mind, it doesn't want to come out. Fuck! It's so unsatisfying. Okay, never mind. I'm sure it'll come back later with twice as much ferocity. Hey you, uh, I got a pumpkin for you. Yeah, needs punch, huh? I don't actually have punch. Oh, wait, what? Oh, it doesn't give me the... ingredients? Interesting, okay. Or wait, am I supposed to... I'm confused how this dungeon works now. Since this is a randomizer, like, everything's gonna be out of order, obviously. Uh, I don't want to get rid of either of these potions, either. These are way better than what that gives me. But the idea is that you're supposed to go through this dungeon and the, the wife sends you on some huge fetch quest to get a bunch of, uh, um, different soup ingredients. Because she tells you that's where the bedroom key is and that's where they're keeping the mirror piece. But it says she keeps forgetting and it's just all the ingredients for soup. Uh, yeah, chicken, cool. Map the mansion, nice. Let's leave. It's actually, everything about this dungeon is very unique, and I like it. Uh, we can solve this right away. So why don't we? Actually, I know why we shouldn't, because I'm, I'm gonna forget how to beat this dungeon then if we go out of order. I am Confucian. How can push block if block not in place? I mean, I'm assuming like this, right? Let's just let's just solve it the normal way for now. I, the intended way is you're supposed to be only only be able to push one of these switches. Obviously, since we have the ball and chain, we can just unblock the second one. I'm not going to do that yet, though. I want to want to make sure that I'm doing this right. I want to make sure that I'm get, getting all the items. Entrance. Left armor, small chest. We that. Right armor, small chest. I missed that, so we have to go back for that. Thank you, tracker. Dungeon map would be that chest in wife's room. Oh... So, Okay, hey, we're caught up. You know, I say that we're going to go in order, and then I I just really want to use this item. Although it looks like that door's locked, so we're going to need to move on anyway. What is in here? What is that? What, what is clanking around up there? Oh, it's those guys. It's the skinny, skinny ice bitches. Okay, never mind. Go, Wolf Link. Oh, okay. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. <laughs> that was really close. Link almost got impaled there. It's a chicken. Um. Okay. Anyway, I guess this is just moving through the motions. Hey, there's a key. Nice. Let's move on. Uh-oh. That's not good. 
Yeah, let's let's go, let's go, let's go. Anyway, how how is everybody? How's everybody doing? I scheduled my first uh, vaccine appointment the other day. And it's it's for tomorrow. And I'm I'm excited. It's the Pfizer one because they canceled J and J, which is the single dose version. Um, like they're recalling it, I guess, because of the side effects or whatever. You got your first shot yesterday? Nice! Yeah, I know uh, Linz went to get hers yesterday as well. Arm hurts, yeah, that's what I hear. It makes your arm hurt and it makes you feel a little weak for the rest of the day. Although I hear that the second dose is much worse. Um, but yeah, I have it scheduled for tomorrow. So me and, me and Gingetto are gonna go get both of ours. I'm still waiting because uh, my mom for another time. Oh no. No other issues other than arms. Yeah. I'm assuming. Oh uh oh. I'm assuming if you're like a a, a, a well fit. God damn it. A well fit individual. Like young individual. Like it's not gonna be too bad. Like the first shot kicked my dad's ass. Um. Because he had a pretty bad reaction to the flu shot a few months ago. But. Like, he was able to get through it, at least. Worried for the second shot, though. That's gonna be soon, I think. Ooh! Compass? Okay. I'm excited. First step towards getting all this shit past us. How crazy is that to think about? It's been a fucking year. More, actually. Hey, I'm back. Uh... Is this where I wanna be? Oh, it actually keeps the blocks in place. That's neat. Oh, wait. I, I think I remember... Yeah, because there's another block up here that I had to push down. Nine episodes should have get... I have to move out of the way. I, I, need to, I need to fucking shrink this chat. I need to move out of the way to see the bottom line of text every time. But you got the house? Nice! Dude. Like... Whoops, that's too little. We're gonna be able to do laser tag. I was like unclear if it would actually happen, but it looks like it's gonna happen. Fucking excited. If that's still like, if if it's still being planned, obviously. But uh, no, a little bit, a little bit bigger. There we go. I think that's right. But yeah, I I just can't wait to be able to go back to bars and stuff again. Like, that's what I'm really excited for, is being able to go out to places. Like, obviously to see friends and stuff, but just being able to go into public settings again. Which I never thought that I would say. Did I do... all of this backwards? Yes, I did, because I need to push the block this way so that it falls down. There. Okay. Wait, then what the fuck is the solution here? What is- oh, I see it. Never mind, I see it. I see it, because this is not a- not an even square. The sneeze is back. The sneeze is back. <coughs> Fuck! Oh my god! Ah, okay. Oh, I'm, I'm so glad I got that out of my system. That was awful. But yeah, I'm- very, very fucking excited. Oh, wait, I have to push this one first. Okay, this is mostly right. No? Wait. No, it's not, because then if I push that... Oh, it's, it's partially right, it's partially right. They stay in place on the ice. I go, I go I do that, and then I do this. And I need that one back there to stay where it is. Perfect. But yeah, COVID shot. I 100% plan to take advantage of that Krispy Kreme deal, by the way. I'm bringing the certificate to Krispy Kreme to get a free donut. I'm definitely doing that. I 100% want to. Uh, there is no way back. That's okay, it's sulfur later. Mm -hmm. 
Hello, your soup recipe is delish. I actually tried making this recipe in real life, by the way. I actually looked up, there's a website for video game recipes, which I, I found when I was learning how to cook, because obviously I'm, I'm a nerd like that. So I, I found a bunch of different video game recipes, like from Zelda and other games, and there was actually a recipe for goat cheese and pumpkin soup that I tried. It was actually really good. I, I actually really liked it. The first one that I tried making had way too much onion. Uh, that was my mistake. Ooh. Like, you get, you get the pumpkin uh, broth. Add a little bit of melted goat cheese into it. Oh. Oh. So good. Uh, oh, hello. You're a friend. Look at how many eyes you have. Oh. It's like a spider. Uh-oh. 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 Link, for fuck's sake. Move. Okay. That was a little bit too close there, buddy. I'm gonna get rid of this for later. My my Nintendo Wii version of this game knowledge has been fucking with me. I can't remember which side. There we go. Nice. Okay, good key. What is that chest? What is... What the fuck? Is this, is this a wolf thing? Man, my special dog senses? Yeah, I do. Wait, I don't know how I was supposed to find this, because there was definitely no marker or anything. Okay. Cool. I... No idea how you're supposed to get that normally. There was no, like, sparkly indication of a, uh, what's it called? Big spot. Oh look, he's a friend. This guy's cool. A little bit chubby. He's got a bit of an ass. A little bit dummy thick, but like... Now that armor will definitely protect you. This guy too. Hmm. This can only be good. Yo, you found my right testicle! I have the left one! Can we... Can I have that other one back? No? Alright. Look, th this entire journey has been about Link trying to find his... Uh-oh. Uh-oh, that's not good. I can't use your item against you? Ugh, yikes. Yikes. Okay. Come on, do it. Fucking throw it. This entire journey has been about Link trying to find both his balls. And he finally did it. Dude, can you... Can you just... <laughs> not... Oh. oh, he's got a little bit of a tail! I don't know why I didn't see that the first time. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. I don't know why I also didn't realize that this guy's literally just a Lizalthos. Probably because I didn't see the tail the first time, but uh... He... Uh oh. No, no, no. There we go. No, no. Okay, okay, okay. Time this well so you don't get smacked. Whew, okay. Not bad, actually. I'm really concerned, actually. Because the fact that I didn't see the chainmail on him when we walked into this room means that he actually took off his pants when Link came in here. He definitely had pants on when we walked in, and now he just doesn't, and that's really concerning to me. Anyway, cool. We have we have our we have our right testicle. 
Nice. Been waiting for that one. Link's journey is done. He can finally call himself a man. There we go. Last chest. These guys have something in them? Okay, well I found out that the goat cheese and the pumpkin are useless, so that's not helpful. These guys definitely have something in them. I don't know why Nintendo would do me like this. Okay. Oh, wait, wait. Wait, was that something behind you? No, just shields. Okay. I gotta say too, I've been learning a little bit about like medieval weaponry and stuff. Just cuz. Just like it's interesting to me. Like Chainmail is fucking heavy when you think about it. Chainmail and plate are way heavier than you would ever imagine it would be. And, like, it makes sense, but it's not something you'd actually think about. It's just like, I, I never would have thought before that you had to be actually, like, super physically fit to wear chainmail or plate. But, like, yeah, it, it kind of does make sense, doesn't it? Uh, these are just cannonballs. Uh supposed to come there. Yeah, they were strong boys. They were they were muscular as fuck. That's why now whenever I see like knights or anything uh oh. I'm just gonna leave you to it. But now when I see like knights and stuff in fantasy or whatever moving around like fucking ninjas, I'm just like, that's not how that works. That that no that's definitely not how that works. They would be tired. Or maybe not tired, but they'd definitely not be moving around that fast. Which is why Link is even more of a Chad than people give him credit for. Because he has, like, chainmail underneath his, uh, tunic, at least in this game. I don't know if that's true in Ocarina. I think it's implied. This, I don't know if you can actually see it. this in here, get a little bit of gunpowder going, aka los bambos. Wait, I put this the wrong direction. No, that's bad. God damn it. Alright, let's reset it. But yeah, like, uh oh. Chainmail, plate, uh, balls and chain. That's fucking heavy. You can't carry that around easily like Link does. And again, it's all fantasy. Like, what is it? What does it fucking matter, right? Can I actually hit him from down here? I would have to turn it diagonally, right? Does that work? Or will it not let me? Oh, stay, stay, stay. No, nope, never mind. I think this is pointless. Link the Twink would not be carrying that around. Yeah, no. Link is definitely not a Twink. He's, he's a little bit of a skinny boy, but definitely not a Twink. Boy is fit as fuck. I can't reach that. What direction am I supposed to go in? <laughs> it's just his pocket, right? Like... I guess in the cartoon, didn't he have a, um, a, what's it called, like a like a magic pouch or something? Or did they say that in like the manual for the first game? That he has some magic fucking satchel, bag of holding or something? It just holds all of his items for him? I thought I remember that being a thing. Get fucked, buddy. Uh, little bit of a double. Nice. I guess it makes sense too, like, if you've ever held a sword before, not that that's like a common thing that anybody can say that they've done, but if you've ever held like a like a prop sword that's made of actual metal, like, even just that is heavy. Even like balanced swords are pretty fucking heavy. You have to be fucking strong to 
to be like anything more than a peasant in medieval times. Most puzzles in Zelda games completely pointless. What the fact that he's just super fucking strong, just able to punch his way through everything. Like, oh no, there's bars on this door. Let me let Link just bend them apart. Oh, I like that there's actual instructions. Insert iron, continue, put in an explosion, and launch. Nice. <laughs> Bare necessities. That was written for gamers. You know, the ones that don't actually want to read instructions. Just like, give me the bare details, nouns, and nothing else. No verbs, only the necessary ones. No, no adjectives. Verbs and nouns, only. Uh, this was not intended for me to have the ball and chain yet. And I'm wondering now what the order of operations was supposed to be in here. Get out of here. Oh, 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 slidey. Got lots of keys. Why do they lock every single room in this mansion? Who were they afraid of walking through the house? Typically you only need to lock the front door, and that was the only thing that was unlocked here. Uh, cool, we got some friends. I, I like these guys, they're a little bit, like, helpless, in a way. Like, on ice they move pretty fast, but like, their single eye, they're just like, Oh, I'm gonna get you real slowly. Uh-oh. Get fucked, buddy. Uh, can I make this jump? Nice. Uh, you need to go. And so does that guy, but I'll wait for him. I'll make it a special occasion. It'll be like his birthday. It'll be his happiest day. Like, oh man. Oh boy, a gift? Hell yeah. Oh boy, I can't wait for my cake. Oh! Uh-oh, wait, actually. Okay, no, this is death. This is death. Actually, a lot of this is death, I think. Jump. Oh, jump. Ah, uh, okay. Bug. 100 smackaroonies. And what is in here? <laughs> the beating heart of a dead comrade. My favorite thing. Courtyard open chest. Partially buried. Uh, pumpkin chest. Going through the tracker right now. Courtyard buried, we did that one. Wooden beam small chest. I think this is the compass chest. South ice wall small chest. I think we got that one. Ball and chain. Uh, yeah. We're like halfway through the dungeon-ish. What's the second floor here? Am I supposed to be able to get up there now? It really doesn't look like it. No, I think the idea is I'm supposed to go back now. Or maybe... Second floor somehow. Which would be back in the main courtyard, okay. Let's do it. Props to Link also for keeping the hat throughout this entire game. I feel like if some spirit was just like, here's the uniform that your dead ancestor used to save the world in, he'd look at the hat and be like, this is fucking stupid. Why? Why did that why did this old guy wear this thing? But props to him for keeping the tradition alive. Like, man, gotta respect it. I definitely think. Wait, 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 wait. No, you know what? I think we're supposed to go back to the main room and use the ball and chain to open up the flush spot. I think from what I remember of this dungeon. Uh, 
I promise it right this time. Please, you look for me. Uh, I don't even know what you're saying, lady. That door. Oh, oh. That's what the ingredients do. I was curious because, like, okay, so we got that pumpkin, right? The only door we could go into this was this one, the one where the, the big guy's making soup. After we got the pumpkin past there... Or no, we got the pumpkin before, didn't we? Either way, this door was opened up, which I don't think it should have been. Now that we have the cheese, this door is opened up. This one definitely had bars over it, so we can go here. I'm understanding the randomizer. I'm learning. I'm a neural net processor, learning the computer. I'm still gonna go back to the main room because I want that chest, though. Just ignore everything behind you, it's all good! Uh... Oh, the chest was behind this one statue that I didn't break. Cool. Glad I paid attention. You got a hundred dollars. Yeah, okay, I'm seeing now. There's this place I can go up to. Although, actually, I don't think I can. Oh, hi. Goodbye. No, I, I don't think I can reach that, actually. I can go in here, what the fuck? Why? Why am I allowed to go in here? Hello? I... Actually, I guess it doesn't matter. I can't even get across there. Okay. A shortcut, I already know that because I was back there. And I also need to bring a cannonball, so this <laughs> is good. Yeah, then just carry it like a Chad, like fucking Atlas. Bring the world on your shoulders. What a dude. If you could just stop being a fucking dork and running into the wall, that would be even better. God damn it, man. Put your head on your shoulders for one second. There we go. Just carry the 20,000 pound ball of fucking metal. Why not? Easy. Uh-oh. Uh oh. That's not okay. Uh. Can I. Oh, I'm supposed to. I see. Stop it. No. Bad dog. You want some too? Uh oh. Bad dog. No. I'm gonna need to bring the cannonball up here. I just want to get rid of everything up here first. Like these annoying things. Okay, let's do that real quick. I keep looking at the the fucking lantern posts as well, and I keep thinking that they're hookshot spots. I'm like, what the fuck? Why? What is the point? It's right up next to a floor. On a very accessible ledge. Like, what what is the point here? No, it's just the game's way of trying to incorporate claw shot spots into the world. Like, fine, okay, I can respect that. They kind of remind me of, like, dart boards a little bit, which just proceeds to remind me of going to bars and stuff. So I'm like, man, I want to practice darts again. Actually, I, I do have a way to practice darts now. VRChat has a, a dart map on it. Can this break? Can I just... This is right above. Yeah. Nice. They have a really good darts map that lets you throw it in VR. And it's super accurate. 
and like easy to practice with. Oh hey, boss key dungeon, boss key dungeon key, boss dungeon. Yes, that's the one. There's that claw shot spot that I wanted. Uh, you are gonna be a problem. You're gonna be a friend. Look at me, I'm marching back and forth. That's what I was born to do. That's what I'm gonna keep doing. It really quick, you just need to die though. I also see that guy, he's gonna be a real problem. He's gonna be a dickhead. He's looking at me like, hey man, I've been waiting for you. Wanna talk? Wanna go to T-Bell later? Ah, I don't. Just stay away. An asshole, okay. Yeah, sink this right, please. I don't think I did that right at all. That timing was really bad. Uh, actually, all of this is really bad because... Uh, any more velocity on this one? Oh no! Okay, that's fine. We have a claw shot spot. It's fine. It's not totally awful. Man, I did a really bad today, or not today, the past few weeks. I've been putting off doing a bunch of essays for my gen ed, gen ed courses that my university is making me take. So now I have like three of them due in a week. It's just really, really bad. But uh, I got one of them done today. And like, I, it, like it's easy, it's like literally fucking middle school level assignments. Like, it's not hard. I can do one a day and be totally fine, but it's still like, still adding stress to my day. Just like, god damn it. Why am I like this? I had so much time. It's like, if, if that was all that I had to do, that'd be fine. But it's in addition to, um, to the chemistry course that I have to take, which by the way, why do they make people why do they make programmers specifically, I should say? Why do they make us take fucking uh, chemistry? How is that relevant at all? Please, somebody, somebody explain to me why chemistry as a school topic is required for programmers. Like, I understand that there's math involved. I understand that there's formula. But formulas you can like plug into and solve and there's like context there but you already get that in normal math courses why is that a thing for programmers this is the second school that i've gone to that they require that from you and i'm like what the fuck how does that make sense at all it's not relevant like i guess you could make the argument that you could be making programs for like scientists to do simulations and stuff, but that's not, that's not going to be an everyday thing. That's like contractually specific and they'll give you the formulas for it. Why? I, I don't know. Maybe I'm just blind to the, to the motivation behind it. It's just so odd to me. Hey, another Sky character. Is that our fifth one? I think so. I don't know if you can see how many you have. Sky characters. How do I how do I see that? <sighs> no, it doesn't tell you. I think that's actually something that it would give you the markers on the map for. But since this is a randomizer, that's cheating, so I don't know what they do to replace that. Uh speaking of, which way do we want to go? Ooh. Huh. Uh, 
which way am I supposed to go is the question. Let's go this way for now. Because I want to. And for no other reason. And turn on my light as well, just so that we go. I can't tell if the light makes the tracking better or worse. It definitely seems to make me smile a lot more, which I think is just the shadows that it's casting. Uh, nice, we have a shortcut back, but we already solved the puzzles, so I think we can move on. This door is unlocked. Oh, didn't I get a big wallet, by the way? Like, I know that doesn't matter, because we have infinite rupees anyway, but apparently, uh... Yeah, we have, a, we have a giant wallet, I think. Oh, hey, buddy! Um... Wait, do I want to go this way? What is this way? Oh, hello! Uh... uh... Uh, uh, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Uh, I think I want to go the other way. Actually, wait, there's a door there, too. What? There's stairs that I can't get to, aren't there? No, because... Okay, going out of order has severely confused me. I'm gonna go back. Because I think I wanna go this way first. I wanna go through the locked door first. Actually, I don't think I do. No, no, I'm supposed to go the other way first. I remember now. I remember specifically that this this is a room where you can't get past that door yet. Because you're not supposed to have a key. God, compare these randomizers to my fucking ocarina ones. It's just like, ocarina, I'm like, go here, do this, go here, do this, go here, do this, make it quick. This one I know so little about, because I've played it, I want to say the least, because I've definitely only played Link, Link's Awakening and, um, like, the DS ones only once before. Probably have played Wind Waker less. No, I think I've actually played Wink. Yeah, I think I played Windmaker less. If I was to guess. Uh, I'm just gonna go down. Oh, I can just walk it. Okay, I thought that was like a slippery slope. Hi! <laughs> Fuck you! Uh oh! <laughs> okay, neat. <laughs> that, that was quick. Take care of them and move on. Honestly, the best way to take, take care of those guys is just kind of fuck them up real quick and then move on. Don't dilly dally or they'll have more of a chance to attack you. Uh, nice claw shot spot. I'm assuming that's for us to get back up. I forgot that I can break these barrels. That's pretty neat. Wait, what is this supposed to do for me? Oh, there's a chest. Okay, I see it. Man, I really like Zelda dungeons. Like, just in general. I really like, like, going through and solving them. Because it's like, man, they're just fun puzzle exercises, like seeing how all the rooms fit together. And unfortunately, there's not any new ones, at least recently, to play. Which is why I have to kind of rely on the old games that I haven't played very much of to, uh, to kind of, I don't know, fill that gap. Entrance Chandelier, we did that one. East Chilfos Chandelier. What does that even mean? East Chilfos. What is a Chilfos? What? We got the we got the entrance one again. Is that the walking guys? Well, there's only two chests, so which which ones do we have left? Hilfos West Cannon Storage. West Cannon Storage 
right. I guess we already got them. If the chests aren't showing up, I don't... Uh, I, I'm not going to think about it too much. I'm just going to move on. Mm. Ah. Excuse me. I need water. Oh, hey, we're back here. Uh, neat. Oh, can we... Oh, I guess we just walk along here and jump across, right? That would make sense. Nice. Yeah, and then this is the locked room. Got it. I think you're looking a little bit chilly here. It'd be neat if you had like a coat or something. I guess actually that like gambeson and chainmail would probably do a lot for you anyway, so it might not matter. No, stop it. Tag dog. Down. No, you too. You're the puppies. Uh, no, shut up. I like how he gets hit. He's like, ow! Oh no! Oh, the ball and chain just pushes those in one hit. That's really neat. Oh, that's so much quicker. I love that. Um. Is there anything in the fireplace? I seem to remember there being a fireplace secret. Never mind. Okay. I need that cannonball, please. There we go. Oh, 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 oh. Turn you around. Ever just watch three streams at once? Uh, yeah, sometimes. If it's like you, Lindsay, and like Barry Kramer all streaming at once, I tend to have a lot of streams open at once. That just happens, you know? It's, it's rough. Hey, I want to support my friends. Like, whatever. I'll just like, what I'll do is I'll turn down the volumes of two of them and have one with the volume kind of cranked higher. So I can kind of focus on that one, and then when I switch focus to another one, then I'll turn that volume up higher. But I still have all the audio going for all of them. Just so I can kind of get a general idea if there's something interesting going on. Like, I can switch my attention. Okay, we only have one shot. I'm assuming it's to take down that big guy. That texture doesn't look that great. It looks like they stretched the texture really wide across the front of that cannon. It's okay. Programming and art design is hard work, I get it. Hey, sick 8-bit. Eight eight bit. Thank you. I'm trying. I'm getting through it. Oh, the... the <laughs> wait, I killed her and then the, the wife just showed up. The wife was secretly the ice monster all along. How did we miss this? Where's the game theory episode on this? Uh, wait, can I get back up from here? Uh, yes, this is where the ladder is. Nice. Yeah, I'm trying. I'm, I'm, I'm not going fast. I'm kind of taking my time with it, but that's just because I kind of want to enjoy the game at the same time. So it's like, eh. Oh, uh, here. Oh fuck, I missed a room. Damn it. Okay, we have to go back. I'm I'm looking at the map and I'm there's a chest right below us. On a new playthrough. Just got done with second few shadow. Nice! Vanilla or randomizer? Because this one is randomized. Randomized uh, item locations and stuff. I've been having a lot of fun. I played this game. Oh this is my my favorite Zelda game, I played this one first. It's just been a long time since I played it last. I'm still kind of relearning a lot of the things. I don't remember a lot of the dungeon layouts. Like, certain things will come back to me. But for the most part, it's just like, ah! Like that. <laughs> Surprises. Just out of nowhere. Oh, this is really not good. Uh-oh. 
Uh oh. No. Vanilla, nice, 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 nice. Uh, no, no, no. Vanilla playthroughs of this game are still a lot of fun. I'm just gonna. You know what? I, I was gonna avoid all the damage, but now I realize that I have so much health that I can just tank everything, so we're fine. Never beat it, played a lot as a kid, never got to the end. Nice, yeah, it's it's fun. I like it, especially the later dungeons. The later dungeons are some of my favorite in many out of many Zelda games. I wouldn't say they're my favorite ever. Because I think certain Zelda games do dungeons better than others. I like this game a lot. This game, it has a special place in my heart, for sure. I do hope that uh, Breath of the Wild 2 has certain, like, darker elements that kind of take from this one, like shadow stuff, or Twilight, like, Dark Realm stuff. At least that's what the teaser kind of seemed like it was doing. Uh, I need to go down. Yeah, there should be a claw shot spot that I can make my way up to. Think. Oh no, this is where the stairs is. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not stairs, ramp. Go on, like, just roll. Roll, 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 roll. It's a miracle he doesn't get dizzy from all this rolling. Oh, I just never went in here. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that explains... That explains why we missed it. Hey, buddy. Really? Really? With your dying breath, you got one hit on me. Oh, good job. Ooh. Was it worth it? Was it worth the death? And he... I haven't really stopped to take a look at the photos either. The the framed pictures. Some of them are just of goats and stuff, which is great. It was so nice. There's a 42. I think. Uh, is that correct? How many are we at? Yeah, 42. So, ready? Yeah, so am I. I'm hoping it releases soon. I understand, like, COVID and stuff slowed down development, so, like, I'm not... I'm not in a rush or anything. I'm just excited, is all. I really want to see how they improve on Breath of the Wild 1. See if they took any, uh, criticisms to heart. All the missable details. Yeah, exactly, right? I feel like a lot of Zelda games have that. If... If running randomized ocarina of time has taught me anything, it's that a lot of Zelda games have so many details that you can miss out on. Like, every time I play that randomizer, I learn of new locations. Even though I've 100 percent of the game before, there's still chests that are like... Like, in the normal game would just be rupees or whatever, but in a randomizer can be 100 percent crucial to the completion of it, so I'm like... I'm learning all new stuff. But it's fun. I like it. Okay, I think... I think that's it. Yeah. I, I'm pretty sure... Let me just check the uh, tracker one more time. Bedroom key... Yeah, I think that's it. I think just fight the boss and we're done. <laughs> Another one on your list to complete vanilla. Ocarina of Time? It's a good one. If you like Twilight, you'll love Ocarina. Like, they're very, very similar in format. Uh, Twilight just has... Twilight takes Ocarina and expands on a lot of the concepts. And kind of keeps it... Keeps it feeling... Vanilla. Mm. Excuse me, sorry, taking a drink, drink of water. Um... Yeah, no, Ocarina, Ocarina is really good, uh, in my opinion. There are certain aspects of it that are like, like obviously it's a really old game, the controls don't hold up that well, but in terms of the actual so. like, gameplay and stuff, yo, thank you for the follow, I appreciate it. Um, it's it's a very good, uh, like if if, even if you don't end up loving it, it's very good to kind of play just so you can see where a lot of the core conventions of Zelda come from. I should probably read what she's saying. Oh, so pretty. Yeah, there's the mirror that we need. Pretty. Oh, so pretty. Yeah, they just found this mirror somehow. They've just been holding onto it. 
Pretty, pretty mirror. Lovely. Yeah, it's really cool. You okay? Uh, not to take mirror. Okay, sure. You can have you can have it literally any mirror. It doesn't have to be that one. Oh, good. You know, I don't really blame her. When I look in the mirror, I just see a shadow demon too. Like all my past like regrets and everything coming back to haunt me. So, all things considered, it's pretty understandable, actually. Hmm. All right. Well, let's just let's just uh take care. Oh no. Okay, we're playing ping pong now. Oh. <laughs> no, damn it. Link, you're gonna have to be quicker with this. I know this is like a 30 ton fucking ball of steel, but like. Now oh, swing faster, buddy. Oh, good, it grew wings. Uh. This is fine. Right? Oh, no. Oh, uh, no, 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 no. Oh, this is hardly fair. He's doing his best. He's trying. I mean, like, he's a little bit of a scrawny boy. Tiny bit of a twink, but like, he's pretty fucking strong. We were just discussing that earlier in the stream. Like, being able to carry around chainmail and hundreds of items, even just holding a fucking sword is pretty difficult for the average person. Um... Yeah, this is fine. All of this is fine. Uh-oh. Link, run, please. Flip down, use the reflection to your advantage, and just run. Uh, okay. Wait, where'd she go? Oh, she's back. Uh-oh. Wait, 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 no, mistakes were made. Okay, I see what I have to do now. <sighs> okay. No, I, I, I see what I have to do now, she's trapping me. Just like, oh, no take mirror, me pretty, but also me want you for a loving husband. Instead of fat ass cooking soup in the kitchen downstairs. 100 plus pound ball of steel. Probably more than 100 pounds, I would guess. Like, if it's made of solid steel, that shit's like at least half a ton. Eh, maybe, maybe a little bit less than half a ton, but like, it's pretty fucking heavy either way. I gotta cut him some slack. Uh oh. Okay. We good? We good? Bring it out and hit. Okay. Okay. We good. Hit one. One out of three ain't bad. Oh, I love the glitter that you put everywhere, darling. Oh, that's so fabulous. Such a good interior design choice. Oh, run. Run, 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 run. Doing the math? Yeah, I am actually curious exactly how heavy would have a giant ball of steel be like. Uh, break, roll. No. <laughs> wow, I might actually die here. That's embarrassing. Never mind. Here's some. Here's some help. Keep going, Link. Keep going. You know, that is. That is actually something that I wonder sometimes is what are hearts in video games? Are they actually the hearts of the enemies? So that's pretty fucked up to think we'll just be eating those for his own preservation. Okay, she's still angry. Oh, maybe I should start breaking them when they actually land the first time. Because it does kind of give me a window. Ow, slowed down too early. Break it, break it, break it, break it, break it. Uh oh. Find the open spot, find the open spot. Open spot! Ooh, that was close. Come on. It's like right there. Oh, uh, uh, uh. If the choir music wasn't any indication for you to run like Hell Link, I don't know what it is. Oh. Okay. I was going to be really angry if that didn't actually hit her.
Oh yeah, she's dead. Oh, never mind, she's alive. Damn it. Nice. Ooh, I never noticed before, but it has like a really, like a really low, like, heart pounding sound effect to it, kind of. It's really fast. Well, we have two mirror shards now. Two more left, Tumi. I'm <laughs> like so angry, he's just like, what the fuck was mine, man? I want to look myself in the mirror. Still, I feel bad about the way we treated that girl. Do you think the mirror of Twilight has the power to change people like that? This world, all worlds, can be cruel. They never really touched on this later in the... I guess... It's like you're fighting bosses that are holding them, so like I guess the implication is that all of them were turned by the mirror. So, let's hurry up and collect the rest of those pieces, Tommy. We have to, before more innocent creatures have to endure the suffering this poor girl did. Well, let's go search for the two that remain. Yep, right to the next dungeon. I, I'm pretty sure we have everything for the next dungeon already. I don't think I have to go searching for stuff. <laughs> oh, Link. You got in the way of their love. How could you? Very strange. You just dreaming, oh. Get a mirror you gave. No. Forget mirror, Yetta. You were ugly without the mirror. No, look into the eyes of Yetto. Look in the reflection of Yetto's eyes. Their true beauty. Oh, she's giving him the fuck me eyes. That's not good. Who need mirror? Dude. He would crack you in half. You sure about sure about giving him the fuck me eyes? Oh no, oh not safe for Twitch. Uh no, get it off the screen, I'm gonna get banned. Oh uh, no. 12 inch ball of cast iron is 233 pounds. Okay, so like half of what I thought. Definitely more than 100. Oh, that was just- wait a minute, that was actually vanilla? What the hell? That's... alright, cool. Uh, let's just- <laughs> let's just leave. I don't want to be here when the fucking starts. I- I really would rather not. Fusion 360 to do the mess. Oh, gotcha. 12 inch. It- it looks like bigger than 12 inch. Well... Yeah, it looks more like 24 inches, maybe. Maybe more like two foot, foot and a half, maybe. Oops. Either way, that's fucking heavy. Link is a Chad. Oh, I need to go... I need to go back. Well, 18 would be uh, 1.5 times 233, right? Half of 233 is 160. 165, 166-ish. 166 plus 233 would be 399, so like 400 pounds. Quick maths. Alright, before we go to the next dungeon, because I'm actually not sure if um, the golden chicken is considered its own check or not, I'm going to get a couple of things around here. It's a sphere, so it's not a perfect multiple. Oh shit, you're right. You're right, I didn't think of that. Uh, wait, what the- oh, yep, yeah, okay, here we go. I like that as a wolf, he walks faster on snow. That's- that's a nice detail. Like, the- the weight spread across the four paws. Damn, okay, just money. So, okay. Let me take a look at the map. We need to go here. There is a golden chicken that is counted on this tracker. 788. Oh. Oh no. Really? Oof. That's huge. That is, yeah, that's actually like half a ton. But like, closer to my prediction actually. Um, I'm gonna really quickly switch over to this view. 
Oh, don't want to see Discord overlay. Can't get rid of that. Um, okay, what I'm looking at on the tracker right now, if I click on the note that we got to get to this dungeon, that cuckoo comes up, right? And that, that makes a new check here, which is the Temple of Time. That's the next dungeon. So I'm wondering if the cuckoo is its own check in the world, and I'm going to have to go find it somehow. I'm not sure, which is why I'm going to go check anyway, because we never set the warp for there. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go check. I'll see if it's there. If it's not, then we're going to have to do some more searching before we can do the next dungeon, which, I mean, honestly, I'm fine with. Uh, really quickly... I am going to go back here. We're not going to go sledding again, unless we have to. Mm. Sorry, water. I'm very thirsty today. But there is a couple of things in this cave that I need to get. I like that it has the handprints from Yeto. That's a great, a great attention to detail right there. Uh, God, I have a sneeze coming on. Sneeze! <coughs> Fuck! Ah. I'm sorry! Oh my god, why am I so sneezy today? You know why it is? Actually, it's because it's spring. It's it's allergy season again. I don't even think I have any major allergies, it's just like... Every spring, two things happen. One, I sneeze a lot more. Two, I get nosebleeds a lot more. But the nosebleeds are because there's just like a change in temperature, or pressure, I mean, in the air. Plus, I've been like, oh, hey, new heart. Um, oh wait, I've been, I've been missing a couple. That's a whole new heart. Okay. Um, nosebleeds are more. Thank you for the bless. Yeah, Link is a strong boy. Um, the nosebleeds are more just because I have veins really close to my my uh, inner nasal wall, as I have been told. So I noticed that I get nosebleeds a lot from there whenever it's like, whenever anything touches it. Like, oh no, you touched me, time to die. Your orange grows and kills you? Oof. Yeah. Like... Ugh. It's like any any sort of physical contact with it, I'm afraid that my nose is just gonna start gushing blood. Okay, that's not exactly what I wanted. Do we have enough... Do we have enough pose for a new reward? We do, because it's every 20. Okay, really quickly. Really quickly, let's go turn in a couple of things, because we have bugs too. We have bugs that we can turn in. We have... Did I beat Star Challenge 1? Yeah, I did. Ba, 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 ba. What is Giovanni's bottle? Did we get that? I think we got that already. Okay, either way, I'm just gonna talk to him and see what we got. Uh, but you, you live near uh, Orange Groves. Is that like? Is that... <laughs> I was gonna say, is that Florida? Because I know Florida has a lot of orange trees, but it could be Georgia too. Like anywhere southern, southern U.S. I have a couple of friends that actually live in the southern U.S. And they talk about uh, like going to pick oranges all the time. Uh, can I shortcut? Shortcut, quick shortcut. Hello, excuse me, pardon me, coming through. Yes. Oh, hello, my fan club. Oh, no, stay away from me. You're gross. You teenage girls. I actually just noticed those teenage girls look like the, uh, the, the three goddesses from the other games. Like Dinfar and Nehru. Because they have the red, blue, and uh, green going on. That's a nice callback. I still checked mark the chicken. My bad. Hello, creepy bug lady. I have more bugs for you. Yeah, I did, unfortunately. Yeah, I know, right? It's like, man, they put everything in here. It's like those three girls plus uh, the reference to Tingle in that minigame right next to there. 
Man, that Nintendo polish, those details. I love them. Ooh, can you give me literally anything else other than a piece of heart? Not what I wanted. Not what I wanted. Yes, it did bring more. Ugh, Tingle. <laughs> I, hey, look. Tingle tries his best. A lot. Actually, no, I can't even really say that. But he's, you know, he does things. <laughs> That's about as much as I can say about Tingle. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba, another postal. Tingle... Look. Tingle tries. Wind Waker Tingle is an asshole. I, I will give you that. Wind Waker Tingle is just like... Like, the epitome of, like, capitalist asshole. It's just like, he'll extort you for money as much as he can. But, like, Tingle in Majora's Mask, he just wants to set up, like, a map-making service, dude. Like, he's... He's just trying to set up his own business. Like, you can't blame him hard for that. Like, he, sure, he is 42, and he wears, like, skin-type suits and stuff. But, I mean... Eh... I don't know. <laughs> He's got a dad in that game, right? Like, he has a family. Hi, Lindsay. What's up? We are going around. I, I don't know if I need an item for the next dungeon. We just finished the ice mansion. Uh, what the fuck is it called? Snow Peak? We're going around. We're seeing I might need... I might need to talk to a man about a chicken soon. That's kind of where we're at. Yeah, dad that wants him to grow up, that's right. <laughs> that's right, he's like, hey, can you please tell my son to stop wearing, like, like, leotards and stuff? That'd be pretty neat. Uh, uh, is there anybody that I can talk to in here? Or are they just gonna tell me to go to the forest? Yep, Sacred Grove, Russell, yep. Like my dad. Oh no. I'm sure your dad is proud of you in some way. Chickens are pretty neat. You know who else loves chickens even more? Kevin. Kevin likes chickens. A lot. I don't know if he's still in chat to refute that at all. But that I that clip of him unintentionally saying he wants to fuck chickens is it, it gets me every time. I go back to that clip sometimes just to be like, man. What a great clip. Uh, oh, it's, it's fucking this way. I went the wrong way when I was searching for the, the guy. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm talking about. The clip that we took of him months ago when he was playing Minecraft. Ah. Uh, I'm, I'm still trying to convince him that he should have a chicken, like a blue chicken as his mascot. Because he has one in his profile pic. Like, that should be his mascot, that should be for his emotes and stuff. I think it'd be hilarious. Uh, hello. I brought- I can't see my girlfriend looking like this. Doggy, please defeat just 14 ghosts more. Never mind, he doesn't get a reward. I thought it was every 20. I guess it's the first... First 20? This is at Cereal Basket Case. He was talking in chat earlier. I don't know if you saw. He, uh, he streams on Twitch, and he plays games, and he was playing uh, a mod pack for Minecraft. We have to breed chickens and stuff. And he, he really loves chickens. He just makes a bunch of chickens, it's great. But he's also a good guy. You, you should definitely check him out if you're interested. He streams a lot more than I do, or at least a lot more frequently. I try to once every week, and if I manage to do that, and like, yeah, that's, that's good enough. <laughs> yeah, go check out that clip. It's great. Uh, is there anything? No, I already, I already got everything out here. Let me find it. Yeah, Zelda game might have the the link for you. I know we definitely posted it in our Discord multiple times. In the uh, the personal one. Um, what am I doing? What am I? What is my goal? No, I just want to leave, don't I? No, 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 no. Wait. 
Because I got the- ah, oh, shit, okay. Because I- I paid off for the Melo Mart, so I think that just unlocks it straight away. I'm gonna need to turn back into a human really quickly here. No, oh, come on, don't make me- don't make me leave town just to change. Uh, okay, never mind. We gotta go. We gotta go. Actually, I, I might be able to do it out here. Horrified screaming. Yeah, I mean, it's like a, it's like a giant. Well, you ever seen a wolf in real life? They're so much bigger than dogs. Hey, what do you like? I like picking stuff up. But I hate stone pavement because it makes my paws hurt. No one understands that. Oh, that's really sad. Wait, dude, stone pavement shouldn't make dogs' paws hurt, does it? Not, not normally, right? I don't think so, because it's like flatter than normal like dirt and stuff. Oh, we got another mirror piece. I can put that. Hey, look, everything's fine. All the villagers are like, hey, did you just see that wolf run by? Like, what the fuck was that? Actually, you know what they're probably screaming at more is they're probably screaming at Minna more than anything else. Can't confirm. Am human. True. Very true. We, we don't really have that perspective. <sighs> I already bought you out. How dare you? How dare you just say that you can't fucking let me in to the store that I bought? <sighs> I think I have to do that, that side quest to open it up, which I don't really feel like doing. So, time to leave. I think I'm just gonna warp over to the next dungeon, see if it's open or not. It should be, based on what we've done for like side quests or um story progress. It should just be open. At least I really hope it is. I see him. Okay. This is the guy that we need to talk to. He should... Oh, maybe he gives it to us? Maybe that's what it is. It has been a while since we took a walk in the forest, huh? Yes, and how our world has changed. Yeah, this guy's part of the Freedom Fighters. He's fighting for freedom, I guess, because apparently the guards in Hyrule, don't, in Hyrule uh, Castletown don't want to do anything. I knew you would come. I have heard of your brave acts from Telma. I have known her circle of friends since my youth, and of late we have begun to work toward a common goal. So, let me tell you a story. Have you ever heard the tragedy of Darth Plagueis the Wise? Do you know about the far side of the steep gorge? Some say there is an ancient temple deep within the woods that guards a sacred power. The ancestors of the Hylians created the temple, signs of their civilization, ancient but very sophisticated, fought everywhere. If someone could obtain the power of those ancient people, well, I am sure it would go a long way towards saving Hyrule. Tool me. Would you take on this task? Would you cross the gorge and find the ancient power sleeping in the temple? <laughs> uh, yeah, sure. I knew you would. Ha! Huh. To cross the gorge, just use my friend? I already said I skipped too quickly. Oh, who is it? <gasps> oh. There he is! There's the boy! There's the golden chicken! You doubt my partner's skills? He flies like a dream, believe me. The gorge. I like that word. Gorge. Engorging. That's, that's a good word. Well, you will definitely make it across the gorge. Wait and see, my doubting friend. Cool! We have the chicken. I... You know, the fact that they put it on the tracker made me think that it was, like, an item that I had to actually get. Turns out it's just a story element. Which, I mean, okay. <laughs> Fine. Uh, can't find it. On his page, can't copy the link. It's, it's, it should just be on his channel. Just, like, scroll down on his channel and then change from, uh, past broadcasts to clips or something along those lines. 
I would hope it's his most be- uh oh. This is fine. This is- This is fine. <laughs> I would hope it's his most viewed clip. I really want it to be his most viewed clip. God, really? <laughs> you fell like a little bitch. Restore the peace. Get back there. Alright, fine. <laughs> Look, I missed, okay? It's not my fault your chicken's really bad at his job. Many more. More that are more viewed? Really? I'm surprised. I've rewatched that one countless times. Viewed, yeah. Come here. I wonder what happens... If I attack this chicken, will I actually... Will it do the thing? Will it do the secret thing? I really want to test that. I love what? Yeah, it's it's like... Do you love what now? Or... Something like that? There you go. Uh, is that the one? Yeah, that's the one. Yeah, it's, it's a really good... It's just... I'm, just, okay, I'm gonna watch it myself. I want to. One more time, it's a really quick clip. Yeah, he like, he whispers it. He's like, God, I love. And it like cuts out on his mic. <laughs> uh... <laughs> no context needed. None whatsoever. Okay, I'm gonna see what happens. Because I've never tried this before. He's a special kind of chicken. What happens if we just. That's lame. That's so lame. My my disappointment is measurable. My day is ruined. I was really hoping that I could fly a chicken or become a chicken. Oh well, that's fine. Ooh. Cutscene? Oh, it's you! You're back! Hello! Back with his usual tricks and bullshit. Yeah, he's gonna run! Yeah, keep running! That's right, I'll get you eventually. This guy causes so much trouble in Majora's Mask. Now he's just running away. Get back here, you fucker. Seeing this though, seeing like the dark forest chasing Skullcat around. It's like, man, oh, what if they made a fucking Majora's Mask remix in this stuff? Oh, I don't want to think about it. It makes me angry. Thinking about like Nintendo fan projects and stuff, fan made remakes and games and stuff just makes me sad like I've, I've stopped enjoying them because i'm just like well now it's never gonna happen like nintendo can't just oh there's a pillow up there that i never got nintendo a is not gonna hire them because that's not what nintendo does unfortunately and b it's like nintendo would never come up with something that cool anyway so it's not gonna happen it makes me sad hello like, Nintendo, come on, just just do what Scott Cawthon does and hire fan game developers to make games for you. It's easy. I, that guy was just holding 200 rupees. That was... He was rich. He's rich for being dead. I guess money holds no importance in the afterlife, but like... Holding on to that. They bought the Luigi's Mansion 3 studio, but that's more like a third party developer. It's not really an indie developer. Uh, what are, what are they called? Fuck, I can't remember. Next Level Games, I think? 
was their name? And they did a really good job on 3. Like, they mixed all the really good parts of 1 and 2. Uh, never mind, that's not a secret. Wait, where did, where did he go? Why did I lose him? But yeah, they're more of like a... Like, they're an actual studio still. Yeah, they did a fantastic job. I loved Luigi's Mansion 3. Um... But there's there's still like a, a dedicated team, right? Like any developer would imply that it was just a couple of people working out of their home office. This thing. This place is really big. I don't remember where all the items are. I'm gonna just. You guys are angry and they're really annoying. Stop it. There we go. Um. But, like, stuff that you see, like, um... I'm trying to think of what, in recent memory, has come out. Like, another Metroid 2 remake, uh, that one came out, and that one was more understandable that they would cancel it because then they eventually made a Metroid 2 remake. But, like, there are other fan projects, like, um... Fuck, why can't I think of any others? The only one that comes to mind right now is... Mario Galaxy DS, and that was years ago. That wasn't even really a full project. Super Smash Flash, I feel like, has gotten a couple of DMCA complaints. Like, just like, requests for remakes of games get ignored largely. I feel like they're missing out. Missing out on big opportunities. And maybe that's just, a, like, them not wanting to spend money, or maybe it's an honor thing because it's a Japanese studio. I don't I don't know what it is. Uh, this way? Yeah, there you are. I don't know. I just feel like a lot of opportunities for remakes of games. Like, for example, and this is just my personal bias, but Chibi Robo has been largely ignored, and yet there are people wanting to make, like, remakes of that game. That it sells well again. Am I just. Is this broken? It led me here, and now I'm like. I have no idea where this guy went. He's literally leading me, leading me around in circles. Where. Where did he go? It this should be the end, right? Okay, okay guys. Alright, look. I know we were having fun, now it's annoying. You guys are the guys at the party that won't stop talking after the third time that I say, yeah, that's crazy, man. <laughs> Stop it. Okay, this way. That's where the light's coming from. Where? Oh! It's up on the ledge. I was just dumb. Okay, please ignore me. Uh, okay. Oh, he has blue fire in there. That's really cool. Dude, where'd you learn to make that? That's, that's, that's a neat magic trick you got there. Oh, 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 oh lame. <laughs> Just disappears. Okay. Big jump. Mm, definitely should have been. Oh, are they blocking me off from going forward? Or going back, I mean. I think they are. Or no, they unlocked this way. This was not here before. Not here? Oh, there he is, never mind. Leave me alone! like the little kid on the playground that gets really angry when you beat him in all the games. It's like, 
let's play kickball, or let's play hopscotch, and then you beat him at everything and he gets angry. It's like, dude, come on, I beat you in a test of skill. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. OBS? Hold on, sorry, my OBS froze. There we go. I really need to get a new graphics card. It keeps doing that to me, and I get scared every time. Ow! No! Stay away! You weird! Oh, I should- I should probably just- That was you. I mean, I, I feel like it was all of us to an extent, right? Oh my god. I will say, his tricks are getting a little bit annoying though. Quick, quick, quick. Oh no, he actually blocked it with one of his guys. Really? Do you see my face? Do you see the face of the annoyance that I'm feeling right now? Nope. While he's, while he's playing the horn. Oh, thank you, okay. Still have to do it one more time, but at least, at least that was one. No, I, I feel like I feel like to an extent all of us were that kid, right? It's like, oh no, my plan was for me to beat you, not for you to beat me. What the hell? Hee hee hee! That was fun. I'll tell you what. I'll let you into a secret place. Okay. I'm not gonna talk about the fact that I look kinda like the hero of old. Or I guess maybe this is a different skull kid. <sighs> Suddenly, daytime. Whoa, okay, I just noticed another detail too. Um I have to go back down to show you, but hold on. Okay, so you know how, like, Link's shield, right? In Twilight Princess, it has this, like, bird design on it that kind of has, like, a hollow center. Can't really see from this angle. But it's, like, it's slightly more detailed. In Ocarina, the bird's body was just kind of like a triangle. It looked a little bit different. It's much more simple. And that's the design on this block, because this is the Temple of Time from Ocarina. Nintendo, goddammit. I, I hate you, but I also love you, and it's such a love-hate relationship that I really despise. It's like you keep dragging me back in. Uh, wait, no bad guys? No bad guys? No, just gonna... Okay, time to turn into a child, I guess. gonna head out. Catch you next time. Yeah, see you around. Thank you so much for stopping by. I appreciate it. And uh, if you enjoy watching more Zelda randos, we're gonna be doing a multiplayer um, mentor race again on Sunday. Hopefully. I think that's the plan right now. Where, uh, where we're teaching people who have never played Ocarina before how to run a randomizer. And obviously I'll still be doing this. I don't think I'm going to be finishing this this stream because we still have a lot of the game to go. But yeah, thank you for stopping by. Okay, here we go. This is what I was waiting for. Uh-oh, uh-oh, wait, that didn't... Oh! Mistakes have once again been made. <sighs> okay. Finally, we have a warp back here. Alright. Here we go. Ready for the best dungeon in the game? I don't know about best, but it's my favorite overall.
Yes. Yes. Look, we're back in Ocarina of Time. Oh, it's so good. Oh, it's so good. Oh, it's so good. I don't- I don't care if it's nostalgia bait. It's so good. Give me the snail. Nice. Uh, do these have anything? I don't think so. We have the item already. We can just go around and do whatever we want. This. Oh my god, we're already at four? What the hell? Why do I keep missing heart pieces? Heart containers? I am Confucian. This was also the room... Okay, does anybody remember the original demo for the Wii U? Back when it was called, uh... What the fuck was it? I think it was actually still called the Wii U at the time. Or like, Project Cafe or something. But they had a demo that was literally just like... Like a showcase of like, the real-time lighting engine or something for the Wii U. And it was like, Link coming down into this Temple of Time. Like, fighting the giant spider enemy. Ah, oh, So fucking good. I'm just- I'm just gushing at this point. <laughs> I should probably focus on what's actually happening, but yes. When, uh, when Ocarina came out, there were rumors, right? There was like a, a Temple of Time dungeon, or like a light dungeon, because there's a light medallion that you just kind of automatically get when you turn into an adult in that game. Hmm. Sorry, water. And so when people found out that there was no light dungeon or Temple of Time dungeon, it was like, okay, well, great. I want to say people were disappointed, but it was like it was like one of those hoaxes, right? It's like Luigi in Super Mario 64, and uh, it was never a thing. And for this game in particular, they were like, you know what? We got to do it. We have to. We have to add the Temple of Time as a dungeon in this game that is technically a, an homage to Ocarina. Like, I gotta give them huge props for that. So yes, welcome to the Temple of Time. It's a dungeon like any other. Uh, the whole gimmick is that we're going to be carrying around a statue later. We'll get to that. Uh, uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. If I could just remember how to start this off. Okay, well, there's lanterns over there that I immediately see. We don't need this because I already pushed down the switch. Neat. Let's move on. Cool. Very, very cool. Uh, lantern. I should have gotten more lantern oil. That was my mistake. I really hope that we don't run into any more, uh, any more, like, lantern spots. That's gonna suck. I think there actually might be a couple later on, but it, hopefully no dark rooms or anything. Not so fast. At last, this is it. This is where I've been trying to get to. The ancient technology of our people. Please stop talking to me. You're just gross. Your baby is literally a flying head. Young man, we're so close, so please help us find what we're looking for. Uh... Okay. Fine. I hate that thing so much. Um, past heart piece chest, we got that. I should probably, sorry, doing some tracker stuff. I'm just pinning the Temple of Time to this. Okay. Uh, Uku is not considered check, so I guess that's vanilla. Okay. Let's move on. Oh god, yeah, also if you have arachnophobia, this is probably not the best dungeon to tune in for. Heal it with fire. 
just absolutely demolish it with fire. I wonder if if the Temple of Time was going to be a dungeon in Ocarina, how many ideas did they take from that dungeon to put in this game? I wonder. I would love to see post-mortems on all the Zelda games. Like, for Ocarina and Twilight and Wind Waker and like just all of them. I think that would be a really cool like, thing to watch or listen to. Uh, this is a situation that can be solved with arrows. Whoops. Nice. Oh, hello! You need to stop! Stab him in the dick a little bit. Nobody can survive dick stabs. Actually, or face stabs for that matter. Ooh, nice spin! Chad Link. Absolute Chad. Whoops. Get out of here. I see you up there. I don't think you can hide from me. <laughs> they were just minding their own business. Sorry, but I gotta take care of it. Oh! Hello! Oh, hello, I'm familiar with you. I don't like your new teeth. Oh. They got, like, gross teeth on the front of them now. That's not cool. Nice. Another chest. Oh my god. Camera, please. Arachnophobia, the dungeon. This is not good for people with the arachnophobia. And I am gonna give that warning very, very seriously. It's not that bad right now, it's gonna get worse, trust me. I don't know why. Okay, so, like, for example, this room, right? With all the black stone and, like, marble flooring and stuff. I don't know why it reminds me of, like, the Empire State Building. I don't know why. Like, maybe it's just the interior design, or, like, buildings in Chicago kind of have that same, like, Greek Roman architecture on the inside, which I guess is more modern than anything else. It's, it's weird, right? It's, it, it reminds me of that more than it does actual Greek and Roman architecture. And I don't know why. It's an interesting thing. Maybe I'm just... Maybe I'm just outside sick. You know how you get homesick? COVID has made me outside sick. I, I really want to go places. Oh, step? Right through the heart. Shot through the heart. And you're too late. You give love. A bad name. Do -do -do -do. Uh, hey, let's get this now. Let's, uh, let's take care of this. Hey. Uh, what's your name? Don Cheadle? That's weird. You have the same name as that actor. You know, the guy that played, uh, Falcon? In, in, in Marvel's cinematic universe? That's weird. Why are you dead in this universe? Oh, it's because Superman actually killed you in the the timeline. Cool, okay. Superman's not part of the MCU. I don't know why I chose Superman. I just had to think of something. My initial go-to was Iron Man, but then I'm like, that doesn't make sense. And then when I thought about it for a second, I'm like, Don, or, uh, Superman makes even less sense. This is real gross to look at. 
I hate a lot about this. I'm gonna need you. For what exactly? I don't actually know yet. But I think everything down here is done, at least. Hard thing is that I don't have the compass, compass for this place yet. Ooh, hey, look! That item? That one item that you got two dungeons ago? Yeah, let's use it once. Okay, cool, you're done. Never again. Never have to use it again. Actually, wait, that's a lie. I think we use it one more time later. That was definitely a situation where they were like, Ah, uh, wait a minute. We gave them an item two dungeons ago. We need to find more uses for it. Uh, across for- Oh, hello. I'm gonna need you. Oh, I hear it. Okay. I need two. And there isn't any on that side. Oh, I could have brought one from downstairs. Well, actually, I don't think I'm supposed to be able to. I just... This is not gonna look, this is not gonna work the way that I wanted to. Nope. Okay. Okay, let's go back. I gotta find something else to replace. Oh, that's what this is for. I'm dumb. We literally just encountered another statue downstairs. Hmm. Hmm. Let's, um... Let's not. Let's just ignore these guys. I really don't want to have to deal with any of that. Baby spiders. I'd really rather not. Wait, did I fuck up? Nope, it's still here. Oh, 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 oh okay. They got hammers. That's that's really not good. Chainmail is not gonna help you with that. That is a different problem than what you're used to. <laughs> Fuck. That's crazy. Just swinging around hammer like fucking nothing. Even though I got the, mo the most sleep that I've probably ever gotten in the past month or so, I had last night. I went to bed, I was super tired last night for some reason. I went to bed at like, like 9, 9.30ish, and I woke up at like 7.30 this morning. I was amazed. I looked at my clock, I thought I woke up late again. I thought like, okay, no, it's gonna be like 3 in the afternoon. Maybe if I'm lucky it's gonna be noon. And then it, I looked at my clock and it's like, like 7, 7.25 a.m. I'm like, what the fuck? Did I sleep through all of yesterday? No, it turns out I was just really, really lucky and really tired last night. I'm really confused, too. I really should get a handle on my sleep schedule. It's been really bad lately. I don't think I'm supposed to be able to do this yet, but that's fine. I think. <sighs> oh my gosh. 
more money. Okay. Uh, real quick, tracker check. Uh, scale room spider chest. Okay. Uh, none of these are what I thought they were. Oh, compass chest. Is that what we got on the other side? Scale room, Hellasaur, no. Armos room, south chest? Armos room, heart piece chest. I'm guessing that's what those were, so I'm gonna mark those. I don't think it mat matters that much. <laughs> oh shit, there's one more floor. I just totally forgot about that. Oh, I know why, that's for later. We're good. Yeah, we haven't actually encountered the gimmick of this dungeon yet, so we are good to go. That's a really inefficient way to put a lock on a door. I just noticed there- I, I guess it's like the kind of door that raises up They do that for all the dungeons. It's just like, why? Why would you put the lock there? The door literally raises up. You can put hands in between the chains. Like, what? I don't think Link's a very smart man. Actually, that again. If Link isn't smart, does that make me dumb? Because I'm the one controlling him? Is that how that works? No, Link is the dumb one. Link is definitely the dumb one. Well, I wouldn't say I wouldn't say he's dumb. I think he's slow. I think he's a bit more of a meathead than anything else. Where he'll he'll do things without really thinking about it. Just because, you know, he's the courageous one. He goes into battle head first. Hello, friend. Uh oh, okay. <laughs> that was a little close. And one more you. Nice. Oh, hello. Oh, we were near. Uh, I'm just. That was a good one for all time. Ah, I'm sorry. Oh, you got a cool, like. You got earrings going on on that skull of yours. That's hardcore as fuck. I like it. Uh, you. Nice. There's a sign up there. I wonder if you can actually read that, if you can get up there. That'd be neat. Nope, fuck you. Oh, I missed! Oh, no! Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. And there's this guy. Okay, come on. Fight me, bitch. Ooh, okay, he's smart. Ooh, he's real smart. I just got caught in the crossfire. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm real sorry that happened to you. Nope. Wow, this guy is really trained in what he does. How did none of that hit? I'm calling a little bit of BS there. Okay. Alright. They're also trained in getting back the fuck up, apparently. Which I'm not a fan of, personally. Uh, I immediately see what's going on. Grab a bit of this. Actually, this is probably not for later. Not for until later. Yeah, okay. Well, hopefully it stays for later. What does that say? I really want to know what that says. That's just mean. Dem devs don't put signs out of reach and then not let you know what it says. Ooh, whoa. Oh, he's got a spiked tail. Yeah, back on the topic of, like, stuff that weighs a shit ton. 
like the shield and armor on this guy. Oh my god. They've gotta be swole as fuck. Come on, just give me an opening, you fat bastard. <sighs> Come on. Yeah. <sighs> really? Am I really gonna be taking pot shots at you now? No, because you're gonna block those too. What is what is the best way to deal with these guys? Okay, never mind. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right in the leg. Right in the leg. Okay, the solution was to go for the kneecaps, apparently. Really? Really? Okay, there we go. Took you long enough, Link. How many floors? Oh fuck, I forgot. This is literally a ta it's a fucking tower. Yeah, we got like two more floors to go. Uh, okay, that's okay. As soon as we get to the top, it's just a straight shot down. Also, if you have arachnophobia, look away from your screen now. It's okay, at least these guys are fun to kill. You just kinda like you just kinda walk around. And then you'll eventually get all of them. They don't really attack you. That actually makes it really sad. I never really thought of it that way. They don't attack you at all. They run away because they're helpless. Oh no. Am I the bad guy? I think I'm the bad guy. Oh no. I, although I guess to be fair, most of Link's lineage is the bad guys in that sense. They go around killing innocent creatures all the time. And they're all derps, too. Ew. 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 Stop making noises, you're gross. Okay, thank you. Oh, Pog, it is a chest. I should probably go back, because that center, um, that center platform probably, if you kill all the enemies, probably has a chest too, that I didn't think about. Uh, uh, scale room spider chest? I'm assuming that's what that is. Did we get the compass chest already? I don't remember if we did. I will check when we get the compass. There's a boy up there. Probably go and grab you. Whoops, that's not what I want. There we go. I really want the Dominion Rod to make a return in one of these Zelda games, or one of the future ones. That and the ball and chain, I feel like were very underused in terms of uh, puzzle solving. The ball and chain was underused in terms of puzzle solving. The Dominion Rod was underused in terms of combat. Because there are certain ways that you can use the Dominion Rod for actually fighting enemies. I hear a ghosty boy. Good throw, Link. Yeet! There you go, that's better. Ooh, there you go. There you go. Oh, that's gonna stay down though now. Yeah. And not if I throw them back. Coming from. Oh, it's way back there. Okay. Uh. I... Yeah, are we good? I think we're fine. Moving on. That. Yes, moving on. Okay, I had to be sure. We are essentially 100% of these dungeons, so I did have to be 100% sure that I didn't have to come back. You're a bitch. Uh, 
<laughs> okay. Um. Uh, wait, what is the plan here? I'll kill you first. You're in my way. Oh, so are you. Wait, 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 wait. You guys keep pushing me out of the way, preventing me from doing my finisher. Learn when it's your turn to die. Oh, oh okay. Uh, this has to be... Okay, 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 okay. There we go. Just get the timing right. Hey, compass. Okay. I'm assuming... Well, I actually don't know if this is the compass chest. Third stair, swinging guillotine chest. No, that's not the compass chest. Okay. Did we miss anything back downstairs? We did. Well, we're going to be making our way down there anyway. Also, there's nothing on that, uh... Uh, where those other spiders were. I just noticed, too, it has the light medallion on the map from Ocarina. So this is definitely a reference to the light temple idea from uh, Ocarina. That's so fucking cool. That is a neat reference. Okay, we'll get those on the way back. Uh, there's one back there, too, that I see. Actually. Yeah. Yeah, we'll get that on the way back. We'll get all of them on the way back. That's the, the beauty of how this dungeon is structured, is that we get to come back and get everything we missed. Ow! Link, you try. You try real hard. I know you do. But could you try just a little bit harder? Just make an attempt. Ooh, hello. Oh, that's a first. My controller died. Uh-oh, that's not good. Uh-oh, that's really not good. Okay, yep, yep. No, 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 no. I, I, my controller is dead. I, I can't. Ah, ah, okay. Okay, so what I did there was I paused the emulator, so... Uh, uh, USB cables, hmm, which ones are available for me to use? Hopefully this one, uh, just, just pull it out real quick, uh, this is fine. Link is just in a perpetual state of fear right now. You know, you ever wonder what it'd be like if time suddenly stopped for you? That's what Link's going through right now, it's, it's... It's actually torture. It's a form of torture, I should say. Where he is currently experiencing all of the fear from that one moment built up constantly over, over a long period of time. Which is only about like 30 seconds or so. There's my there's my controller. Um Let's 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 hope that this works. Uh, uh, uh. uh oh. Nope, it doesn't work. It doesn't work! <laughs> uh, maybe if I switch up the controller, no, fix input, oh, maybe I need to get rid of the other one. Technical difficulties, we'll be back very soon here. Uh, maybe I should actually, there you go, is it, is it, is it doing the thing? Controller readings? Yeah, it's it's there. The controller is definitely connected. Uh, let's close that. Close that. Okay. Nope. Tell you what. Uh, I'll be right back.
Okay, I fixed it. I had to change the device, because it changed for me. Uh, we're back. <laughs> sort of. Uh, yeah. yeah, we're back. Okay. Just, just run. Link was in horrible pain during that entire time. He got hit right before I paused the emulator, so I was just like, oh no. If what I said actually applies, he's in excruciating pain. Okay. This is... Uh-oh. This is a bad sign. All of this is, actually. Uh... Ball and chain? Swinging around that ball? Uh-oh. Yeah, come on, come at me. Oh, they go for the back. I see, so they do attack me. Really? I'm just gonna... You know what? It's, it's quicker if I just go straight for them. Back you little shit. Attack me while my back is turned, huh? How noble of you. By noble, I mean go die. There. Oh? Okay. Hey. I need you to be alive for like two more seconds just so that you can go back and die. Oh. Okay. Uh -huh. Oh, they got like. They got like rib cages too on their backs, you can see. Like the whole front is just the armor, and then by their armpits, you can see the rib cage. That's really gross. I love it. Okay, cool. Uh, switch? Switch? What are you? What are you? Are you a Nintendo Switch? Or are you like a bottom top kind of switch? Like a I can be in either position kind of switch? Either way. Pretty. Pretty useful. Um. Is this a mini boss? Yes, it is. Ooh, okay. All right, you ready, chat? You ready for the? You ready for the boss that really solidified my love of this game in particular? This is the one. This is actually the one. A drink of water, real quick. Oh. Look, one night to another. Proper duel. It does, there's the fucking light medallion on the floor. I never even realized that when I played this the first time as a kid. That's really cool. Here we go. From one night to another. Proper duel. Ooh. Okay, okay. This is gonna- oh, this is gonna involve some actual, like, tactics. Waiting for an opening. Uh-oh. Okay. Really glad the shield is up. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, come on. I, I, I'm at his back. I should be able to hit him. But yeah, speaking of uh, knights in medieval times, I'm getting really lucky with these fucking blocks. Oh no! Speaking of knights in medieval times, the ability to carry all of this shit on this guy is just like... How fucking strong is he? This guy's superhuman. Uh-oh. I'm, I'm really trying for that back slice. It's not, it's not working out for me. Nope. I'm assuming arrows are not gonna- I can't just- Yeah, no, I can't just shoot through the fucking slits in his helmet. Fuck, I'm gonna have to attack him head-on when he swings his sword like that. So try to avoid that, too. Come on, do it again, bitch. I'm ready. Oh. I can never tell if he's gonna swing twice, either. 
There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Nicely done. I really should be able to attack him from the back. I guess that would make it too easy. Yeah, openings, openings, openings. Okay, your armor's falling off. What are you going to do about it? You're nothing without your armor. Nothing. Nope. Oh, fuck. Ball chain. Does the ball chain do anything? Nope. Ooh, good to know. Ah, fuck. He's not gonna be off my feet, but he's not actually doing anything. He's not falling through with anything. It's really frustrating. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm gonna back up out of the way and then How did that miss? That I'm calling BS on that one. Uh oh <laughs> Link's like, what the fuck? This guy's insane! Alright, now we're fucked. Trained Knight without being slowed down by armor. It still has a chainmail and a sword, like, holy shit. Ganon trains them well, apparently. Oh, he just went for the fucking kick! What an asshole! Uh oh. Alright, Link, you might wanna. You might wanna watch out. He literally just chucked his sword at you. He didn't even care. Yes, there we go. There. Knock him, off, knock him off his feet. And just don't let him do the same to you. And it's all good. Shouldn't Dash do anything on this guy? No, apparently not. That does, though. Which I didn't expect. Oof. And stay down, bitch. How dare you throw a fucking ginormous sword at me. That was badass, though. I love that. All of that for the soul of a ghost. <sighs> okay. I'm really hoping... I'm, I'm really, really hoping that the reward for all the post souls is actually something incredibly crucial. That would make it seem all worth it. Okay, let's, um, we found our gimmick. We just need to bring this guy all the way back to the beginning of the dungeon. Ooh, magic. Look, we got a friend. What? Are, okay. Question. Should we give this guy a name? I feel like we should, right? <laughs> what the fucking badass? Okay. What does he do to these guys? I want to see him just fuck up these guys dead. Oh, yo! One hit kill. Okay. Huge fan of that. What? Are, what does he look like? He he kind of looks like a Larry to me. Or a berry. Or a Mary. Could be a girl. I don't know. Larry, Barry, or Mary. Uh, I kind of like Larry. I think Larry's pretty good. Larry's, Larry's gonna be our friend. Larry's gonna help us out. 
the oh link i can't get up there oh thank you for lowering the stair thank you oh so helpful no problem larry i got you you got my back i got yours there is a bit big and slow but he's he's got the spirit he's oh careful he's he's more uh brawn than brain you know ow Hey Larry, press on that switch for me. Oh, you got it, Link. Or told me. That's your name, right? Yes, it is, Larry. I told, mm. I told you a few times already. Uh, did we miss any chests back up there? No, we didn't. I need to be sure to be on the lookout for those. Um, Larry, would you mind? Whoops. Larry, would you mind? Oh, is this thing hurting you, buddy? Oh, here. I'll just take care of it. Oh, this one, too? Oh, yeah, you got it. Like, thank you, Larry. <laughs> just fucking annihilates them. Oh, no problem. Me want smash. Yes, I know you do, Larry. Big smash. Big smash, keep me safe. That's always appreciated. Uh, this is awkward. Oh, this is really awkward. I'm gonna need to bring you back there. Wait, can you kill? Can you kill the Nemo's like normal? This is really embarrassing. I need to actually start clicking hearts. Oh, it is a it is a switch. Okay. Um. Uh, da 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 da. Stay back. Before you get hit again, Link, goddammit. Need to get Larry all the way over there! Okay, close enough. Oh, Link, there's a stair here. I'm really big. I can't get up it. I got you, Larry. Like, you're... You're a little slow, but you got the spirit. That's what really matters. Uh, 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 okay. There you go, sleepy time for Larry. Sleep in the big bell and I'll meet you in the next room. Nice. Oh, oh. okay. That was about to be a big whoops moment if I ever saw one. Uh, there's a chest. Somewhere around here. I think that's up on the higher level, though. If I was to guess. We never went... Ah, oh, fuck. We never went up to, like, the second area here. We should definitely do that. Let me get this guy down first. Larry needs help. Larry's... Larry's big and slow. He needs a little bit of assistance. Can I get you over... Uh-oh. Becker. Ooh. Wow, Larry, you really are just gonna have to go down the whole way. Uh, okay. Let me... Uh. You really just can't jump down. You, you're really gonna have to... Uh. Okay. Well, while Larry sits there and contemplates his existence... Uh, there's a couple of things I need to solve first. Specifically this, because I really want to. Actually, how do we even... How do we even reach that spot? Or is there one up here that I'm just missing? No? No, none of these, apparently. Really? Huh. Maybe other side. Well, I need to. I need to get more. Um, more of these chunky boys, anyway. Uh, arachnophobia. People with arachnophobia should ignore this. Uh. Uh oh. Alright, 
Larry, look, I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm doing this because you're useful to me. I need you still. Oh, I can climb up to these things. I did not know. That's probably how I reach this. Yep. Oh, there's a whole room over there that I didn't get to. Why did I not? Did I just already have the key and I didn't even know? It's a bit early. Oh yeah, 10, 1080 skateboarding. Oh yeah. You need to get down here. Oh! Uh, you're Barry. You're the... You're the, uh, the other name that I didn't use. The, the name itself. Just, just the name, not an actual person. The name itself died. Thanks. Yeah, little did you know, chat, whenever I give you an option for a name, like multiple options... Ooh, that's important. Whenever I give me an option with multiple names, uh, those other names actually just die. They're physical forms. It's true. It's like, it, they take a manifestation somewhere else in the world. And I'm like, well, do you want this one to be Larry? Or this one to be Barry? And then you choose Larry. Barry manifests itself as some other dude somewhere else in the world. Uh, but then he's actually dead. Oh, no! Same thing with Mary. And any other name that I have given you an option for. I am really low on hearts. This has never happened before. Oh my god. Please, thank you. Health, please. More health, please. Chest. I should probably update this tracker. Third stair window chests? I'm assuming we got the compass chest already. Yeah, dominion rod, yep. Scale room upper, we just got helmosaur room, yeah. We're about to get the big key chest. And there's a second stair heart piece chest somewhere. I don't know where that is. Oh. Oh! Okay, so we skipped two. Okay. <laughs> These fat boys on here. They're a little bit chonky, right? Like, look, they got, like, really silly, like, faces. Oh, and, like, the hole is the mouth, so it's just like, oh, They're constantly pogging. What am I missing? Wait a minute. There's four switches. Oh, the the, the shells. Uh, wait, 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 wait. When in doubt, use the remains of your enemies. Yeah, perfect. the Hawkeye. Okay. Not that I need it, but I was just curious where it was going to be. Okay, sweet. So, okay, looking at the tracker, right? Uh, the only item that we really need is the double claw shot, I think. 
Oh, and we need we need the sky characters, that's right, to get to the next dungeon after this. So we need the double claw shot, the rest of the sky characters. I don't know how many there are. We have five right now, I think. Uh, and then I think we can beat the game from there, because we already have the light master sword. Or the, the powered up master sword. Yeah, I think so. Oh, wait a minute. Where did you go? Where did you, where did you go? Wait a minute, where did you go? Where's my boy? Where did Larry go? Larry? Larry, I need you to come back, buddy. Oh my god. They didn't have to reset the room. Get all these little tiny Larrys. <sighs> okay. Yeet. And another one for your yeet. And another one for your yeet. enough for now. Oh, I'm not gonna be able to fucking... Uh, uh, okay. Balancing. Scales. Perfectly balanced, as all things should be. There we go. Larry better be over here. Larry, if you're not... Okay. Thank you. Oh, I didn't go anywhere. I was waiting for you because I was scared. Okay, thanks, Larry. Thank you, Larry. I appreciate you. Oh, no problem. I'm gonna need one more, aren't I? I guarantee it. I guarantee that I'm gonna need this last one. Which is why I'm gonna go get it anyway. Uh, excuse me, pardon me. You know, I can't really say that I hate these creatures, because they have four legs. Like, they have gross abdomens, but in terms of, like, like creatures with more than four legs are what should all die. That's always been my motto. But, like, these things have four legs, so, like, they should be as cute as dogs, right? Okay, all of you. All of you are annoying. I'm just gonna... Let you do your thing. Uh... You know the worst part is I'm gonna have to throw every single one of these back over again. For fuck's sake. Uh, I get it, I get it. Weight, mass, yes. Thank you for your physics engine, Nintendo. You didn't have to make the puzzle take this long. This one, I told you I was gonna need all of them. And it's just barely. Give me, give me the stick. Give me the pleasure stick. Nice. One more time. Oh, can I help you? No, it's fine, I got it. You don't have free hands, you have a hammer. Oh, okay, I'll just sit here. Yeah, you do that. Thank you, Larry. You can help out later when I have to ask you to crush thousands of enemies at once. Oh, yeah, I like to crush things. Yeah, I know you do. Oops. One more fat guy. Go join your friends. <sighs> Alright, Larry, you ready for the crushing that I was talking about? Oh, boy! Let's do it! 
get fucked, spider creatures. Yeah, kill all of them. Out, not me. Yes. Do it. Execute order 66. Oh, Link just slide out of the way. And just because I don't want to leave you out. There, join your friends. <laughs> oh, I'm back from my nap. Oh, Larry's ready to smash. Are you? Are you, Larry? Oh, boy. Here I go. Uh, oh, 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 camera. Oh, camera. Nice. Our physical limitations can hold us back no longer. Uh, there's a chest over here that I missed. Actually, I don't think I could have gotten this last time anyway, so... There we go. Uh, let me do me one more solid. Stand on this pressure plate. You're a real bro, Larry, you know that? Like, I get tired of you sometimes, but like, overall... Pretty chill dude. Nice. Uh, that is everything. Oh, it's milk! Oh, wait, hold on, was that... No, fuck, it's not a bottle. Damn it. Uh, wait, 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 wait. I immediately realized my mistake. Alright, let's go, Larry. You and me. Tag team duo. Oh, boy! Do I get to smash things? Yes, you do, Larry! Coming right up. Right around this corner, hopefully. Yeah. And hop. Nice. And... Ooh, it's not there. No, I want this one. Yeah. Uh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. What is the chest here? Oh, I just never got this. <laughs> I'm stupid. Okay. Nice. Only 11 more of those total in the game. That's really impressive that we've gotten basically all of them. Let's go. Uh, wait a minute. What the fuck? Wait, where do you? Oh, there it is. There's your platform. There's your home. Go to your home, Larry. Oh boy, Betty times. Yes, Larry. Can you read me a story? No, Larry. I'm short on time. Aww. Okay. Around this way? Let's go up. I hope so. Yee. Okay, Larry. One last trip. We're almost there. We're almost home, Larry. Oh boy. Do I get to see my family? Yes, you do. Yep, you have your 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 brother right downstairs. Oh boy. I'm not going to really tell him that his mom and dad died, just to keep that a secret between you and me and child, okay? I'm just going to go with this, it's just his brother for now. Uh, more things to crush, Larry. Oh boy! Not me. Not me. Please, not me. Good, good, good. Yes, crush them all. You not me, not please, not me, Larry. Oh 
Careful. Yes. Do it. Heal them. Uh, ooh. Hey, one of them escaped my grasp. Get back here, you think you can run? Okay, you're just... I lost patience with you. Oh, shit, that was actually necessary. Nice, okay. I had I had no idea. I was like, I didn't even pay attention to the electricity there. I was just like, oh, I'll get out of here eventually. Just a little... Oh, no, that was a mistake! I am... I have a lot of regrets. I didn't think that they'd actually punish me for breaking that. I just wanted revenge, damn it. There he's back. Larry's gone. I I should probably break a couple of pots for health and stuff, right? That would be the smart thing to do. Cool. Out of four pots, I got one heart. Thanks, Zelda. Thank you, Nintendo. I should have played this game on hero mode. I don't know what I was thinking. Should have gone hardcore. All in. Fuck you. Uh, ooh. Okay, interesting scenario. I... Oh, I see it. There's a... There's a... There is a claw shot. Like, wait a minute, what the fuck? Nintendo would not soft lock me like this. Um. Actually, wait, 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 wait. There we go. Larry's back. Time to smash. Oh, pa. We're just going? I guess we're just going. All the way down. All, all, all the way down. Go there. You go as fast as your stub can take you. I don't know. You lose your, you lose your legs, Larry? Yeah. How'd you lose them? Oh, I was, you know, making a cake. I, I don't really want to know the end of that story, Larry. It sounds awful. Yeah, it was. I feel bad for him now. Here, go go take a rest. You deserve it, buddy. You you deserve it. You're just, just... Just a little bit more. There you go. You know, Larry's a good dude. Honestly. He's a little bit annoying at first, but honestly... He's, he's pretty chill. He's just misunderstood. I think. Hearts, give me hearts. Come on, game. I don't want to waste one of my really good potions. I feel like I'm gonna need more hearts than this, but okay. Oh boy, my home! Yep. You know it, Larry. We're home. Good, lots of pots in here. Yeah, see, Larry, there's your brother, right there. Oh, Carl? Oh, Larry. Oh. So good to see you. Carl, buddy. I've been going on with this Larry bit for way too long. I'm sorry. It's okay, here, Larry, just, here, your home. Just, just, just get to your home. Oh, boy, I'm home. Carl, so good to see you. Oh, good. Now I have to listen to Larry for 10,000 years again. Look, Carl, he's not that bad. Cut him some slack. Uh, is that the dungeon done? 
Yes, it is. Just a couple final trials, and then we're done. And yeet. And this is always- oh, fuck. This has always been a weird room to me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, that's real bad. No, not what I want. Fuck. This has always been a weird room to me. It's really, like, lighted weird and stuff. Fuck me. God damn it. Lighted weird, and there's weird traps everywhere. It's like, what the hell were they doing in the Temple of Time? Like, like what the fuck is this thing? Or is there just a chain? I don't know, it's weird. Maybe they were practicing some voodoo shit. Uh, okay. I missed. <laughs> that guy just fell into the abyss. Sorry, buddy. It's, it's nothing personnel, kid. Yo, full heal. Okay. Finally, the end of the dungeon. Oh god. What sort of horrible monstrosity awaits us? Is it gonna be a robot? Those guys look big and scary up off in the corners. Oh. Oh. <laughs> no, thank you. This guy has more than four legs. Oh, good. Oh, my favorite thing. Oh, my favorite thing is when they have more than four legs. Good. Okay. Good start. <laughs> Just fucking crush him. Oh, that's really satisfying. Okay, that's actually that's that's not bad. A nice a nice callback to Ocarina. It's just Goma but bigger. That's all. Uh, huh, huh, huh. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Fuck you. Fuck you. Oh no, get rid of them. Yeah, that's another callback to Goma. I. Oh. He shoots lasers! Okay. I didn't know he shoots lasers too! Come on, stop and look at me. <laughs> Fucking slamming. Ugh, ugh, ugh. Again, really gross. Let me guess, you're gonna have children again? Please don't. Okay, thank you. No, no, don't do it! No! Stop it! Oh god. Kill them before they can wake up. Yeah, Link is screaming the same way I would be screaming at these things. Where is he? Stop shooting the laser. Oh, yo! I didn't think I would actually hit that one. Yeah, fuck you, dude. I hate spiders. Hmm.
Does the, wait a minute, he's a spider, does that count as like a spider driving a mech? <laughs> the eye was the actual spider, the rest of it was just the mech that he was driving. Spooter got wrecked! Hi Mute, welcome back. Uh Yeah, it's gross, right? Oh, ugh. Not not my favorite boss ever. Three of the mirror shards are ours. Just one left. Mm-hmm. But at what cost though? Two of me. I might have spider in my spiders in my shirt, you have no idea. You saw how nasty that monster was, right? Yes, I did. The evil within the shards is more powerful than you can imagine. You know, we could be a something something truly terrible here. It could be something that we'll ultimately have to destroy. Uh, I don't know. Maybe. Is that foreshadowing? We have to hurry. Let's find the last shard, Tumi. We have to reach the sky. That's where the last shard is supposed to be. Cool. First, first let me grab the heart of the spider. It was money all along! Money is the root of all evil. We all have a skeleton inside of us just wanting to bust out. Ugh, that's, that's a really creepy way to put it. <laughs> but yeah, technically. Wait, I don't know about wanting or waiting to bust out, but there is a skeleton inside of everyone. That's true. Yes, I would like to save. I would like to save so I don't have to encounter that horror again. All jokes aside, it, it's not really my favorite boss. I, I feel like there are better bosses in this game. Because it was very much just like a hit it, use the item, done. Do it three times. Although I, I did like that little last bit where, where the eye turned out to be the main spider. Okay, ooh, wait, hold on. Nice. Dummy thick. So, okay, next up I have to get the second hook shot, or claw shot, as well as... Why are we in the Temple of Time? Good question. You'll just have to play the game and find out. It's a, it's a neat little callback. Yeah, spoilers. I, yeah, probably should have mentioned that because I am going through the game in order and I'm like pretty late into it. Uh, we are done with this area, though. So now, we're not doing any story stuff until I can get the items that I need. Which can be anywhere in the world. So... Uh, fuck. Where do I even begin? You know, I guess going back to Kakariko would be a good start. Actually, yeah, that's next in, like vanilla story route so maybe maybe that's where it intends me to go we're not gonna be able to do uh let me think about this for a second we're not gonna be able to do hidden village unless that's unless that's like a story trigger that i can just do it now that's why i'm gonna check so let's go let's go find out hi opona hi opona Oh, I might need... Fuck, I might need Ilya's charm. I might not have any of the items to move forward. You told me, I remember you being saved from a dangerous situation by someone. Someone told me all about the Rod of the Heavens. Can't remember who, why, where, what. Uh, do you really think I'll recover from my memory of a complete stranger like yourself got caught? Uh, yeah, okay. Oh! Wait. We have an item? Why? Okay, I, I, uh, I, I don't know how I missed this one, but we have that now, I guess. Okay, what does that do for us? I keep forgetting my actual playthrough of this. Writing in the book was a spell that imbued the staff of magic, so now you can do to the other statues what you did before. Okay, no, because I've definitely been down here, this is all just skipping ahead in the story, because it's a randomizer. So this chest would be 
what would it be? It would be the item that this guy gives you. So we need to go around the world searching for all of the fucking... Okay, I'm just gonna, instead of talking about it, I'm just gonna go do it. It's just, I have to go to certain areas in a certain order. That's, that's all we really need to get out of it. Best experience for first run through. Um, you're talking about like what to play it on? Like what system? Because if you, if you have to choose a system, I would say... I would say the Wii U version, the HD version, is probably the definitive version of the game. Because you can switch between um, the normal GameCube version and the mirrored Wii version of the world. Good settings on an emulator. If you want the best graphics, go for running it on an emulator. So like, I am... Uh, uh, not not canon on stream. Uh, I'm totally not running this on a dolphin emulator with an HD texture pack and shaders at all. Definitely not. But if you if you had to choose like what what to use, that would probably be the best for like graphics wise. Um, in terms of features, the HD version for the Wii U has the most. So yeah, no, totally not. Totally not running this on an emulator. This is my legitimate Wii U. That's why the textures look so up -rest. Um. Yeah, if, if you don't have access to the Wii U, that would probably be the best. Uh, if not, I think after that... Oh, cool, it just is going to give me the item. It's not even going to do the cutscene or anything. Um. Nice. Invoice. Yep, I've got to take it to the doctor. Can I talk to the people in here yet? Are they going to show me the locations of the statues? No, it's just going to show me where Shad is, which I already technically talked to. Cool. The Nintendo, the Nintendo police are going to get me. They're going to find out where I live and fucking break down my door and arrest me. No, but if you if you cannot get the Wii U ver like it, it's a choice between whether you want to play the Wii U version or run it on the emulator. Um, if neither of those options work, try to get it for GameCube. If that doesn't work, just use the Wii version. Wii version, the only reason I put the Wii version below the GameCube version is because uh, my arm gets tired after waggling the controller around. <laughs> That's literally the only reason. Um, other than that, they're pretty much the same game, just flipped. I should probably equip that invoice if I can. I cannot. It's a story item. That's cool. Hey. Uh, okay. Wait, am I not supposed to be able to do this yet? Is this a nighttime thing? This might be a nighttime thing. Actually, I don't know. I don't know what the order of operations is here. I'm supposed to. Ah, uh, fuck! I'm supposed to be able to use that item. I guess it doesn't. I'm just wondering what the order of checks is here. That's I'm like going through it in my mind. Technically, I'm supposed to be able to. Um. Oh, I already got the archery heart piece. I mean, shield I got, Hawkeye I got, coral earring I think I got. I got Ronaldo's letter. Why it does not? Okay, I'm gonna pull up the tracker for you guys so this isn't super boring for you. There you go. I already got Ronaldo's letter. I don't know why. I don't know why. Oh. Wooden statue. What is the wooden statue for? What? Okay, South Hyrule Field has something for me, apparently. So, I, I guess I go back there. The order of this is so confusing to me. 
<laughs> Birds! Still blows me away. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. I I try. I it's it's not perfect, and I wish I could have done more things on it from scratch. Um But yes, I am I am a fan of it. I like the ability to I like the, the fact that I put this one together so I could put like hats on it and stuff for the different games that I play. Like putting the link hat on was super fun. So, okay. I really need to know how many more letters for the book we need. That and the double claw shot. I need to know those two locations. They could be anywhere. So, here we go. Yay! Uh, chest? in South Hyrule Field after getting an invoice. What could that even be? What order of operations would that be? It's not that one. Clearly. I already got it. Uh, that way is already open. But around here... Why is it here? Why is it in South Hyrule Field? What made them decide this would be the location? It turned to a wolf just faster. I have to become a furry for a second. Just for a second, though. Uh, nothing. Oh, there really is nothing around here, is there? Oh, you're just not afraid of me. That's cool. Uh, no chest. No chest. This one is open. It says wooden statue. There's no wooden statue around here. Is it you? Is it Agatha? 14 bugs. Only 10 bugs, yeah. Why? It's not that one, I already got that. I'm like 100% convinced that it's in Castle Town and this tracker is lying to me. Watchtower Alcove. I, I don't know if I got that one. I'm not paying attention to the game, sorry. Giovanni's... Uh, East small chest and Giovanni's bottle I got. Invoice is a chest. In Castletown. Um... I might just- I might just wait for nighttime. I think I'm supposed to come there at nighttime, specifically. We're gonna run around a little bit. Actually, if we're just waiting for stuff, I might as well go run around searching for items. Uh, let's go. Let's go here. We really haven't explored much of Hyrule Field yet, so that that might be that might be best. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Yeah, around here, there's a couple of things. This is actually one of the skybook letters that we need. Or it would be, normally, in vanilla. Or... Let's 
Let's go adventuring, go running around like heroes do. Here's the thing, I could have gotten this a long time ago. I don't know why I didn't. Of course, of course it's gonna be money. Because why wouldn't it be anything else? Uh, you, I need to jump across there. Beautiful. Also, it's nighttime. I need to go immediately back to Hyrule Castle Town. That's fine. Let me just get the oh, fuck. Let me just get this last chest here. So I'm curious, because, uh, are you okay with me using your, your VR chat? Because I've never actually, because I know that you're SVM on here, are you okay with me using your VR chat name just because I'm familiar with that, or not, would you prefer me calling you SVM? Either way, it's fine with me. But I'm curious what your opinion is, because, uh, I talk a lot about how I'm excited for Breath of the Wild 2. I'm curious, because I know that you don't like Breath of the Wild 2. Like, what? Oh, there's a Poe out there. I need to go grab him. I'm curious what you would want to see from the sequel, if anything. Like, how 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 would they change it? Maybe more linear? Because I know that the the open world is not. You're not the biggest fan of it. I'm curious. You're the first person that I've ever met who didn't like it. So like, I'm curious to see your thoughts. If you're still around. Uh. Don't have the double. Don't have the double claw shot, so I can't get over there. I already did the grove that way. Yeah, let's go grab this guy. More excited for the story than anything. Yeah, that's fair. I. And it, it's okay if I call you mute. Okay. Uh. Ooh. Um, yeah, I'm I'm very excited to see where they take the story with the sequel, because to me, the story felt a little, not lackluster, but it, it, I feel like they definitely could have done more with it in the first game, in Breath of the Wild, um, feels like, like, it was, it was a good way to do it, having it spread out like that, and I feel like it was kind of the only way to do it with how they set up the gameplay. I just kind of wish that there was more, I guess. As far as changes, stick to Breath of the Wild 1 style with a few tweaks here and there. That's what I'm wondering. Yeah, you were telling me you're more a fan of the more linear ones. I, I like them both, but I like them separately. Um... Breath of the Wild, in my opinion, is... It's very, very good, but it cannot be compared to previous Zelda games, just because of how different they are, right? Like, Breath of the Wild feels like it was such a change that it it's really unfair to look at a game like Twilight Princess, for example, and say that you could compare the two, whether one was a better game or not. I think they're different and in their own categories. Um, that being said... I am curious to see how they change how they change the style for Breath of the Wild 2 because I feel like they're gonna go more linear. I feel like it'll be open world still, because they definitely I think they definitely found a formula that was very popular with people, but it'll be interesting because just from what we've seen in the trailer, it looks more confined, I guess? It depends, because we don't know anything about it, right? All we know is that, like, from the trailer, Link and Zelda were underground somewhere. It's presumably underneath Hyrule Castle. So, like... Hard to get in for the wild. Decent time, I think. I don't have time for it right now. Yeah. It's... Yeah, and it definitely seems like it's gonna be a lot darker. Ocarina to Majora, yeah. For sure. Um... I, I definitely think it's gonna be how do how do I get in there? Go away! 
I can't. I need to get that chest, and I can't. Um, yeah, I, I think it's going to be definitely an Ocarina to Majora kind of thing. Although, even without the amount of time added because of COVID compli complications, um, still feels like it'll be bigger than Majora's scope was. Uh, which is why I'm thinking maybe they'll have a slightly different direction with how the gameplay goes. Like, maybe more open world, but have more linear, larger dungeon sections, like underground, or something of the sort. Um, I don't know. It's, it's hard to say anything because we know so little about it. We've gotten basically nothing since they showed that first trailer. I'm curious. Uh, don't you sell? You sell something. Can I... <laughs> Did I fuck myself? Did I fuck myself by going out into the open? Come on, just let me change over here. <sighs> okay. Watch me play first if I can't get my hands on it. Interesting. <laughs> I, I don't know if I'm gonna stream it, is the, is the only reason. Uh, I might, I might, I, uh, I might stream it. Only reason that I have hesitation on it is because I would want to stream Breath of the Wild first, and right now I don't have any way to stream Switch games. Like, I don't have a capture card, so I would need to get one. Well, honestly, by the time that game comes out, I might have enough money to get one. We'll see. Okay, I'm just going to leave and turn to human and come back. I don't know how the fuck I'm supposed to get into that fucking get to that chest in the the hospice there. I'm excited for it though. I'm I'm very excited. to Get those donations to support a capture card. I mean, uh, maybe I don't know. I do have a Streamlabs page where I think technically people can go to donate to me. So that's down below. I don't advertise it and I don't have like, I don't have a big neon sign that says donations here or anything. To me, I stream because I want to. And that's kind of how it's always been. But if people feel like supporting me to get a capture card so that I can stream more games, that's also cool. <sighs> I don't know what the fuck. Do I talk to you? Bad detailed directions. Do I go back? Do I go back to Kakariko? Why did it open up in Southern Hyrule Field? That's what I want to know. Why did it open a spot for the wooden statue down there? Out of everywhere. <sighs> I'm so confused. Just make VR check content. They're trying to support content creators now. I. <sighs> So many good changes on the way. We'll get to that in a second. I want to talk about that. But in terms of like making VR chat content, I don't know. <sighs> I'd like to, right? I would. I would like to be able to stream VR chat because I think it's fun. Um, but I would have absolutely nothing to do on stream. I was considering maybe I could do um, streams just showing off, like doing world showcases. Like going around and showing people like, hey, this is VR chat, this is how it works, and there's some neat worlds that you can go to and play through, and like, I think that'd be fun for stream. It, it wouldn't, like, it wouldn't be consistent content, but it'd be something, I think. Um, so I would like to do that eventually. Make models or peeps or worlds? Yeah, well that's, that's kind of what I want to get into more. Um, is doing creative streams because I've done a couple of creative streams before. There's a Poe over there. How did I miss you? Um, like I was, I was working on accessories for avatars, and I want to do one. I have an idea to 3D model a a Tumby from the Discord server. You know the one, little little Tumby Drumby guy. Want to make a 3D version of him, and I'll probably stream that. And I have I have like ideas for 3D modeling streams. Uh, just 
recently, Zelda randomizers have been taking up my interest. I'm doing more of those lately, but I'll definitely get back to more creator stream stuff soon. Um, yeah, definitely. I like doing those too. They're they're really fun. Like I set out with a goal when I start the stream, and then by the end of the stream, I usually have some working version of that thing. Usually, it still needs polish. Like the time when I made the the Beat Saber saber for myself, that that was not ready by the time I was done with it. But like after it, after stream, I went and fixed it up, and now it's working. Um, but things like that, right? Where you you go in with a set goal. And then you kind of show it off in game afterwards. Like those are always fun to me. Uh, I am just gonna. I give up looking for this wooden statue. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go do the other checks that I said that I would do. Um, and in terms of um, the VR chat update yesterday, yes, did you see that? That stuff is so cool. I. I'm, I'm glad that they addressed all the bugs because that's a huge thing, right? Like, they, they definitely needed to, and I'm glad that the audio bug is top on the priority list. But, I don't know. There were complaints about the new UI. I think the new UI is pretty good. I, I think it's it conveys a lot more. Um, and I think overall, it's, it's easier for new people to kind of get into, understand what's there. Creative stuff is great. I, yeah, I, I, I agree. I I like doing it. It's it's fun. Um, the new UI looks fantastic, and the avatar dynamics they finally they finally killed off dynamic bones. I'm so excited for the fact that they killed off dynamic bones. That shit's so CPU intensive. Like they finally have their own version of avatar dynamics going, which is going to be fantastic. I'm really excited for that. It's amazing in concept, yeah. I mean, they they said that it's going to be more performance friendly, and I'm hoping that's the case. We have yet to see, and there's still going to be a ton of avatars that use dynamic bones, but the more people that add the new system to their avatars, the better the game is going to run overall, which is 100% necessary, I think. Like, right now you go into a world with like three or four people, and if those three or four people have really intense avatars, and they just don't care about the performance of other people, like, you're gonna die. It's really, really bad right now. So, I'm glad that they're implementing, like, a proprietary system. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm not paying attention. Grotto. Grotto, grotto, grotto. Grotto, there's a grotto. Uh-oh. Okay, there's a grotto somewhere around here. finally have an event with 40 people and get like 20 extra frames, right? Like, it's it's unthinkable. That shit is unthinkable now, nowadays. Oh, this is bad. Where is my... What is, what is my fucking indicator here for where this grotto is? I can't see shit. Where is it? Yes, Avatar Dynamic System, and, uh... It said something about European servers, too. I only watched half of the presentation that they did. They really want my butt. That butt is my butt. It's nobody else's butt. They're not allowed to have it. Where? 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 Where is it? In Japan servers too. Nice, even better. Okay, you know what? You know what? You know what? You all are fucked now. You are absolutely boned. You pissed me off for the last time. Why do I have 53 post souls? Am I really that bad about keeping track? I'm also gonna really quickly. Might as well. You know what? Well, I'm taking a quick break. I might as well save state. Nice. Uh, not what I wanted to do. 
Okay, all of you. All of you need to stop. Oh no. No touchy. This is sexual harassment. I'm not gonna stand for it. Nope. Nope. Don't even try it. Where is this grotto? It's supposed to be around here. I actually just cannot see shit. It's supposed to be out in the middle of this fucking field. How would anybody find this? Like, where? Where? to provide HR himself. Yeah, HR is uh, called left fist and right fist. Yeah, I'm looking at this tracker one more time. Here it is. It's right... right on the, on the right hand side, right Hyrule Field, right in the middle right there. Freestanding chest, lantern chest. Grotto, specifically. I... I have no idea. Is it down here? Is it in the water? That would just be mean. Like, I guess I could always come back, but like... Why? Don't make me do that, game. Uh, that hog's just running around. He's having a jolly old time. Real good time. Oh, there it is. How the fuck? What? How did anybody find that? Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. How is anybody expected to run around Hyrule Field randomly as a wolf with their senses on when you can't see shit? Okay, okay. I'm just learning new things about this game. It's fine. Uh, you need to stop. All of you need to stop, actually. Actually, should I just should I just not even bother? And yeah. Yeah, this is better. Hello, yes, I am HR support. Your time is now forfeit. <sighs> okay. Strategy guide. I guess... I, I guess, technically, yeah, you could use a strategy guide. Yeah, I gotta sell the strategy guide to make that extra buck off of those uh, completionist players. It's true. This was still like, what, 2006-ish? Yeah, like, like on online strategy guides were like, a rare thing. Actually, were they? I don't know, I feel like in 2006 even I was looking up strategy guides on the internet. GameFAQs.net Oh. Remember game I think he's done that? I do. Good times. Not really. I had to search through everything just to find what you needed. Like a giant text document. Okay. So for future reference... Oh, actually it does have a little bit of a visual, even if you don't have the senses on. Okay. Yeah, it was it was starting to right around then. I remember asking uh, at my local Hollywood video. I remember asking the the clerk there um, how to get past a certain part in Wario World, which I don't know. If, I don't know if anybody remembers that game. It's a GameCube game where 
Wario from the Super Mario series was the protagonist. It was actually a lot of fun. I'm, I'm surprised that they never made a sequel to it. Um, and I remember asking him how to get past a certain boss. He's just like, he's just like, just use Google. I'm like, what the fuck is Google? <laughs> I didn't say it like that, but I'm like, uh, how, how, is there a way that I can find out how to move past this part in the game? Because you guys don't have the strategy guide in stock. Yeah, sometimes poorly structured, yeah. And they would have that ASCII art at the beginning, like every single one of them had ASCII art of like the game's logo or something at the very top of it. It was a strange time. But um He was like, yeah, just go to game FAQs and they have strategy guides for everything. I was like, <gasps> What? What do you mean for free? It's like, yeah, for free. I'm like, oh. And then from that point forward, I never paid money for a book ever again. <laughs> no, that's a lie. I had to pay for textbooks in college. Unfortunately. Which, it's, it's crazy that they still make you do that. Like, buying thousands of dollars worth of textbooks for college. Like, fuck off with that. You're already paying hundreds of thousands of dollars for college. Or maybe not hundreds, but tens of thousands. It's like, why would you make your students pay for textbooks on top of that? That's so dumb. But yeah, it... Wait a minute. Oh, they're... They're just waiting for me. They're just hanging out. See? They're right there. <laughs> they're just like, oh... Oh, we're gonna get him. Oh, as soon as he comes back this way, oh, he's fucked. Nope, not today. Uh, really quickly. Yes, college, college is an absolute mess in America. It's really shameful. Is there a Poe around here? No, there isn't. Okay. Yeah, schooling in general, just the education system. In America is really not good, actually, as I have learned. Pog, a snail. That's one more prize from Agatha. Uh, this goes to Kakariko. Is there horse grass anywhere around here? I really hope. I don't think there is. I want to get on my horse. I need to speak to a man about a horse. Here we are. Easy. Da da da. Da 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 da. Go, horse! Go! No, wait, not that way. Shit. We got a little bit too excited there. Yeah. No, just, just do 180. Real quick 180. Yeah. Actually, you know what? Wait, hold on. While I'm here, I'm gonna check something. Yeah. I am fairly certain yeah. that uh, the invoice just skips me along. Do whatever check is down here. I think. Only a half hour away. Close to home. Get your stuff set up tonight. Nice. Yeah, if you're on, I'll I'll definitely try to hop on too. Uh, can I talk to you? Boomy saved. Yup. Yeah. Never mind, that's not what I thought it was. I need to get the wooden statue. What the fuck? Oh! Wait, I think I know. I think I know. I think I know. I think I know where I need to go next in the story. 
And we're actually on the way there already, so this kind of worked out. There's, there's a part of the map that they tell you to go to during this portion of the game that I forgot about. Um, and you do a bunch of side quests there, and eventually you do a side quest that leads you back to Southern Hyrule Field, I think? So that might be why the check is showing up there on the tracker. Oh, you're an hour ahead of me. Oh no, we're not in the same time zone anymore. Oh, that's a shame. That's okay, at least it's not like a two hour difference. It's only one hour. But yeah, definitely, if you can get on. Uh, I'm gonna pause real quick, just so I can do this. Mark it off. Uh, I got Renato's letter. What is what is on Grand Trail Alcove? Did I get the Alcove up piece? I thought I did. I think I did. Goron Mines? I didn't get everything from Goron Mines? What the hell? Oh, outside claw shot chest! We never went back for that! Oh, we have to go back to the Goron Mines eventually. Maybe. Well, it depends. It depends on if I uh, check everything else first. I still don't find it. Oh no. Fuck off. Okay, jump off. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay. Yeah, if you, if you can, right? Like, if, if you get tired, or if you're, uh. If you end up staying up late trying to like unpack everything, like don't worry about it. But, um, I know that your your sleep schedule is almost just as fucking mine is. <laughs> so either way. My sleep, gotcha. Okay. Yeah, no problem. I might also. Well, it depends if you'd want to go to uh, the event later, the cuddle portal. Because uh, I might, I might stop there for like a few minutes just to say hi to people, and then I can come hang out with you. But it all depends on timing, anyway. So, where, where, where is this golden boy? Where is this twinkly motherfucker? Where are you? There you are. Here you are. Another pose soul. We are six pose souls away from being able to 100% that. That's fucking insane to me. We might actually 100% the pose. That's stupid. <laughs> Why is this game gonna let us do that? Uh, oh, I remember what I need to do here. I had half of the solution. There was a gap. I'm like, oh, I need to put a statue here so I can jump across. The statue's not there. It's way over here. Oh, you what, mate? You what, mate? Yeah, fuck you. Depends on the state of the basement, how much you have to move everything around, yeah. Fair enough. Like I said, no pressure. Uh, this is the way forward. I don't really want to move forward necessarily, but I'll open it up. Item tracker? Yeah, I like it. I, I spent a little bit of time trying to set it up because um, the the normal item tracker is very square and I couldn't fit it anywhere on the screen so I had to like capture certain parts of the window and then stitch them together. Yeah, I like it. I think it came out good. I'm wondering if 
like, if they ever come out with the Skyward Sword randomizer, which, from what I've heard, it's in the process of being made, uh, if I ever decide to play that on stream, that would be a time. Because I... No offense to anybody who likes Skyward Sword, but I hate Skyward Sword. Very much so. It's very much, in my opinion, not a very fun game, so... So it'd be nothing but me shitting on it. How am I supposed to get up here? Oh, there's a claw shot. I just can't see it in the dark. But so far, like, playing all of these Zelda randomizers in order has been so much fun. Like, I'm, I'm almost sad that I didn't do... Like, I only did the main Zeldas. I did Zelda 1, Link to the Past, Ocarina, Majora, Wind Waker, and now I'm doing Twilight Princess. Kind of sad that I didn't do um, Link's Awakening or Zelda 2. Like, I feel like those are the two that I would have wanted to. <laughs> I I try. I, I, I take pride in my uh, dream layout. I spend a lot of time fucking around with it. Um... But I would love to... Maybe maybe one day. Ooh, hey! That's another. How many How many are there? Oh, we're just missing one! Okay. I think. It doesn't show... There's still other missing characters. It doesn't show us how many we have in the menu, is my only problem with that. Like, I can't... If I, if I use it, does it say anything? No. Okay. Um... What was I saying? Yeah, eventually, if I if I decide to continue the quote-unquote series of Zelda randomizers, I might go back to do Zelda 2 and Link's Awakening. Maybe some other ones, if there are other ones. Like, maybe the DS games for Phantom Hourglass and Spirit Tracks. Just because I haven't played those in a long time, and I feel like replaying them would essentially be like a brand new experience for me. Oh, there we go. Uh, ooh, okay, we got a bit of a micro dungeon. Uh, okay. Let's just jump into the abyss. Cool. There you go, Link. Just absolutely brutalize them. Leave no room for error. Destroy your enemies, become a god. Uh, another one of these. I, I really like the mini dungeons in this game. I've already gushed about it a little bit uh, on previous stream. But I think having little areas that are entirely optional for you to go back and like complete and get a cool reward out of it is a lot of fun. God. There we go. I think one one element that I would probably do, like if I was, whoops, oh I think my controller died. Hold on. Um, I think one element I would probably take from Zelda games past, if I was to like implement it into a new one, into a new game, I mean, um, would probably be to like keep the micro dungeons that are in, or the I call them micro dungeons because they're not really mini dungeons. Like I would consider Bottom of the Well in Skyward Sword or er, in uh, Ocarina to be a mini dungeon. These feel more like micro dungeons, where they're like a couple of combat things and not very many puzzles. Um, but have like micro dungeons and bring back more optional items, like key items, key weapons and stuff from Link to the Past. Because you have like the King of what is it? Rod of Somalia or something, or one of them. It's like the blue rod that uh, acts like a wand. It's like an entirely optional item, but it helps in combat. Like it's stuff like that, like rewards for that. 
I think it's a really neat idea that was never expanded upon in any other Zelda game, besides like Breath of the Wild, a little bit. I pulled on by Scarlet Swords, like a character, Fee. Yeah, I, I, I like Fee. I, I like Fee. I like Fee's character. I think they could have done more with her. I feel like she was a little bit... In terms of character development, she doesn't have any character development. Like, she kind of exists. There's, there's the tiniest bit of character development with her where, like... I don't know. It, 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 I don't know. It, there's very little of it, right? Which feels like a bit of a wasted opportunity to me. But as a character, I really love her concept. <laughs> Like, the idea of a spirit hidden inside of the Master Sword is such a cool idea. And I was I was freaking out when I found out about that. When they... When I was a, when I was a kid, right? Twilight Princess was my first Zelda game. I played Ocarina after that. And after I played those two, they released the first teaser for Skyward Sword, where it was Link with a shield but without a sword, and it was Fee right behind him. And I was... Like, people were theorizing that Fee was the Master Sword, and I was just like, Oh my god, that's so cool! I, I got, you know, I was freaking out about it, I was super excited. I feel like even as a kid, um, I say as a kid, it was, it was only like, what, 10 years ago? I was, I was what, I was 14? I was still technically kind of a kid, um... But I was super, super duper excited for Skyward Sword, and I, I still liked Skyward Sword and his story. I was always a huge lore nerd when it came to basically any video game franchise. But like, the idea of a cool story mechanic in Skyward Sword, and in Breath of the Wild too, like all the stuff with the Guardians and ancient technology, that pulled me in right away. Um... Oh, can I just not... Is this... Okay, that's it, apparently. Okay. Where's the... Wait, where's the... Where's the statue? Um... But yeah, even though... Even though there are arguably better stories out there in video games, in other places if you go looking for them, um... Zelda always keeps me coming back, just because of that that connection that I have with learning about its lore and like being hyped for games and stuff, at, like when I was younger. Plus, just the fact that they're well-designed games, like that always helps. Uh, this guy. Uh, here we go. Really long adventure across this giant bridge with no guard railings and a bottomless pit below. What can go wrong? So... Did you, uh... Did you watch the game last night? You into sports? Sport ball? Anything? This guy's not much of a talker. Ow, don't shoot me, I was trying to have a conversation. No. God damn it. Ooh, oh, fuck. Okay. Uh, good to go. And uppies. Link just wants uppies sometimes. He's, he climbs up, he's like... Ledge, give me uppies. I don't know where I'm going with this bit. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, hi. You just dinked it off my shield. How? You're really lucky. You get a quick death. Okay. <sighs> really? Okay. Oh, what the... No, stop. Um, really quickly. Let me, I can keep Poppy on the screen, that's fine. 
Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. looking at the tracker. Excuse me. Uh, there's a grotto around here. I did not know there was a grotto near here. Okay, we got the owl statue. We got the. Oh, we didn't go back for the skybook letter. Oh, I'm a dummy. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay. Um. Stock cave. That was the micro dungeon. We got the heart piece chest, the lantern chest. There was a Dodongo chest. Was there? Uh, mute. Were you paying attention? Was there another? Was there three chests in that micro dungeon? I don't blame you at all if you were not paying attention whatsoever, but just in case. Uh, okay, go back for the skybook letter, get the grotto that's near here, and then we can continue forward. At least that's the plan. Oh boy, I hope I don't jump into the abyss. Oh, okay. That could have ended badly. There we go. Come on, be a vanilla item. Give me a letter. Or the claw shot. Give me the second claw shot. Nope. Just money. Oh, crap. Oh, I didn't- I'm- oh my god. I didn't go back for the fucking grotto. That's okay, we get to ride on our horse a little bit more. We get to spend quality time with our horse. We haven't done that at all this game. I will say, too, if they, like, obviously this would never happen, because it's Nintendo, why would they? If they made a Twilight Princess 2, for example, in the vein of, like, of the Wild 2 or Majora's Mask, I would absolutely want them to expand on certain concepts. Like, make the items more useful, make talking to animals more useful, because that's the thing you can do as a wolf. You know that? It's... That's 100% a thing, and it's just never utilized. Oh, uh, God. Uh, maybe I'll be able to see it without the night vision. Or sensory vision. Where the hell... Okay, okay, okay. Okay, now you guys are getting annoyed. Nope, don't you dare. Okay, let me take a look at this one more time. There is a... Grotto Water Bomb Fish Chest. Somewhere to the southwest of here. But like, around here-ish. Where the hell... Oh, there it is. That was easy. Oh, Ooh, good. Oh, good. Just some friendly fish. The chest right there. Sweet. We can just... This will be fine. This is totally fine. It's actually not that bad. Gonna head out for that? Okay. Yeah, I'll see you around. Uh, hopefully later today, if you if you can get on. But yeah, thank you for stopping by. Appreciate it. I've been going for four hours. Okay, I think I'm gonna... Uh, do I want to end stream yet? Let's go Let's go do one more check and then I'll end stream. 
I want to go at least get to... I want to at least get to the Hidden Village and start that whole quest. I'm hoping I'll be able to. I'm hoping... I'm hoping it is what I think it is, and the way will just be open, because that's a story thing that we should be able to, like, encounter right now. I think, maybe, I, I could be entirely wrong. Could be right... oh, hello. Okay, interesting. There's... oh... No, 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 no! I'm sorry, Epona. What is going on here? Why is there just a second way here? Oh, okay. Cool. Just an alternate route. Go, 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 go. Slay your enemies. Fuck, the wing is closed. Okay. That's concerning, because that means that I'm missing a story element of this game that I don't know how to activate. And this will definitely not blow it up. Yeah, no. I remember trying that. Fuck, okay. Uh, in that case... Okay, that's okay. We we have some we have some grottos over here that we can get at least. So this trip is not for nothing. Okay, this isn't ominous at all. Just, you know, a few chests just open out in the middle of nowhere. Okay, it says that I can get to the hidden village. That's annoying. That's annoying because I have no idea what it, where or how or why. Uh, that's okay, just don't worry about it for now. I'm just gonna ignore the middle of the room. I'm gonna ignore the middle of the room? That was just one puzzle, right? Yeah. Wait, I definitely thought I clicked that. Apparently not. Never mind. Okay, what do we got? Nice. Four more. How the fuck are we 100%ing the pose? I swear to god, if the pose end up being something critically important, I'm gonna be angry. There, there really just no other... There's two chests, and the one big one, and they said that there was supposed to be Stathos in here, but apparently not. So, okay. Skateboard. Run away from the arrows that are shooting at me. Like a little bitch, I mean, what? I'm just gonna. Why? 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 Uh, 
Hey, Twilight Princess randomizer devs, I think I found a bug. Uh, I don't... I mean... It, there you go, there's the info, I guess. Whatever you need. Current event ID. Next stage, whatever that means. There's all the console stuff. Um, that's the seed. And there's all the data. I I don't you you can pause it as you need. I just I don't know why there was three chests in one spot and none of them gave me an item. Probably because I don't have the slingshot. I think every time it does that, there's supposed to be seeds that are like ammo for the slingshot. Uh oh. That's okay. Uh, not gonna worry about it. It's fine. Hey, look, North Hyrule Field. We've never been here before. Um, what is what is here? What is here on this tracker? In this location? Grotto? Ice block puzzle? Ooh, I actually remember that one. Pine gate underwater. Uh, uh, sure, we can try all that. Dun, 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 dun. No, no. We got the frozen lantern chest. I don't know why I didn't mark that off. We're actually doing it. We're slowly getting rid of all these checks. Okay, ice block, grotto, behind gate. Let's start south and go north. Because then the rest of that is just. There's a grotto there? I should probably go back and do that one. The spinner thing there, the looks of it. Yeah. Okay. Let's just play the game, as they say. Behind gate. I did not know this existed. I I have never had to go down to this lake. It's cool looking. I like it. There's just no need for it. Uh, let's, let's go for a quick swim. Hey, there it is. Uh, boots? Nice, what we got? More money. Hate to see it. Ah, oh, that's okay. What is this boulder? Why is there just a random single boulder underwater? So why are there why are there ledges to get up? There's no reason for that. You can swim. Money, of course it is. That's basically the only reward in this game. One thing I will say that the HD version did right um, was it added sort of kind of more rewards to the game in the form of those stickers, which are pointless because Miiverse is dead, but like, they added, they added stickers that you could use in Miiverse, which are like a nice little extra collectible. Oh, hello. There's actually a current here. Out. I don't know why I thought that could go in any other direction other than bad. Okay, let me out, let me out, let me out. Uh, let me put on my pretty blue tunic again. Wolf goes faster. And go searching for a grotto. Uh, it's actually... Oh, fuck, it's not gonna be on this side of the river. Eek. Actually, where would it be? Where... There's just a random grotto somewhere around here, supposedly. That's not it. That's too small. Uh, 
checking the tracker really quick because I don't know this game at all. I'm learning, it's been fun, but I don't know what I'm doing, 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 do, doing, 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 doing. Uh, ooh, hey. Nope, Wait, there's actually a golden bug in here? Wait a minute, what the fuck? Uh, golden boy? Hey, there you are. Wait, where's your friend? Isn't there one more friend around here? No, okay. no, all the golden bugs have, like, two variants. There's the male and the female, and they're all supposed to be in the same general area of the map. Like, if you find the male, you're gonna find the female somewhere nearby. I might have to go... I might have to go looking for that. Ooh, hey, puzzle time. Uh, fuck. Do I have the brain power for this? Probably not. Let's do it anyway. It's simple, we did this already. Actually, th we did the same exact puzzle. Oh, wait, I did this wrong already. God damn it. Wait, 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 wait. Sliding block puzzle. The pinnacle of Zelda. Isn't this a thing in every Zelda game? Does every Zelda game have a sliding block puzzle? I'm actually not 100% on that. Oh. Uh. Huh. You're looking the run? Thank you. Hello, Lunar it's, it's It's not really a run, it's more of like a... <laughs> I've never played a randomizer of this game before. I'm experimenting with it right now. Oh, this, this is the same concept as the, the no peak. Okay. But so far I'm enjoying it. So far I'm having a lot of fun with it. Wait, is it the same concept? Oh. Am I stupid? No. Yes. I am. Oh, it's this way around. Then I can do- no, I can't do the other one. No, I need to move the other one first. My brain cells, I can feel them expanding. It hurts. Do this, and then the other one, and then the other one. Okay. I get it. Yeah, I so far I'm enjoying this randomizer. I'm excited for the 1.0 version that they're gonna release. Because I feel like if they polish this up a little bit more, maybe changed up a little bit of the logic here and there, um, so that it was a bit more open, uh, I feel like it would be... It, it would definitely be one that I would come back to more often. Because, um, like with Ocarina, like... Ocarina of Time, I I do that one all the time because it's like it's very polished. You kind of already know where a lot of the secrets are, and that that that's more like I'm sure that could happen with this game too. Um, but it's 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 very polished in its logic that you can if you if you know what you're doing, you can complete them very very quickly, which is kind of the point where I want to get with this one. It has a lot of pot potential, for sure. Um, and I, I'm, I would love to see this randomizer get a ton more love. Um, to the point where it's like, as, you know, as popular as running Ocarina. I think that'd be a lot of fun. Um, definitely for me, because like, I, I love this game from when I was a kid. 
I love playing this one. So for sure, I would love to see it more. Uh, my brain. Uh, my brain. I can't go down because then I can't push that one. Did I do this in the wrong order? Did I do it in the wrong order? I feel like I did it in the wrong order. <laughs> I feel like I have to take care of that other switch first. Then push these down and around. But yeah, in terms of potential, like, it definitely has potential. Because, like, my favorite thing about Ocarina is that you can do everything in any order because the logic allows for it. Um, which is why it was a little... Whoops, I did this. Uh, nah, I can fix this. Um, which is why, like, it's it's weird to play this one, like, a randomizer of this game in order, in, like, vanilla dungeon order, which I get is necessary for certain things. Um, I, still, I still think that there are ways that they could make it less linear. Which I'm hoping is what they do. Like, for example, like the items, the, the quest items, like Renato's letter and <laughs> the invoice and stuff. Like, those could all still be randomized, but they chose to kind of give it to you after you complete Temple of Time? For what reason, I don't know. But they did it for some reason, so it's, it's interesting. Um... This is a little awkward. This is a little awkward. I think. No, it's not. Wait, yes, it is. What are you doing. What am I doing? Built into the game so com. Complex logic isn't really possible. Oh, for real? They're actually changing it to be um, like a patch ROM? Because that, that I would much more prefer. Because the, the console is a cool idea. Um, and it allows for some really cool things like, you know, in game item searches and stuff like that. I. Whoops. I didn't want to do that. Um, but. The fact that it's all done at runtime leads to a couple of weird things, like you have to make a save state if you want to save your progress properly. Um, you have to know how to use the console, which in itself is very daunting for newcomers. Um, and I think that's part of what makes Ocarina very, very popular. Uh, this is not going to work how I want it to. Generate an external seed file, load it into the third card. Oh, so it's more plug and play, is what you're saying. Or isn't that how it already does it? Or no, 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 no. Right now, it like it, it you use um, rel loader, and then the randomizer takes up a save spot, and then that's how you uh, you run it, and then it generates it on new files, right? And that's how you, like, through the console, then you uh, change the seed and stuff. Yeah, either, either, either way, like, changing it to be more useful would be helpful, I think. I'm not going to get anywhere if I just stand around, so I'm going to... Let me just push this one out of the way, I guess. Why can't I solve this puzzle made for children? Or is it... is it this way? It's this way. You use this as a brace, and the other one moves onto it. I am overcomplicating this, aren't I? Mm 
Yes. No. Yes. Yes. Okay, this will do it. But yes, so far, randomizer, very well made. Especially for the, the amount of time. Like, has it only been in development for like a year-ish? Or at least that's that's the first time that I remember uh, seeing that it was in development. Because I remember actually like looking up um, if there were any Twilight Princess randomizers. I think it was about a year ago. And I didn't find like anything. Like there was one project for um, the Wii U version, but it wasn't really a real randomizer per se. Uh, it was just like uh, I don't even remember what it was. I think it was like a master quest for Twilight Princess or something like that. But, like if if my memory is correct, I think I think this one's been in solid development for about a year. For a year's time, like, pretty damn good. I don't know how old, like, the Ocarina randomizer or Link to the Past is by comparison. They're all wonderful, and I enjoy them. I'm excited to see how the Skyward Sword randomizer works, if that is even a thing being developed currently. Oh, do I... Uh... Huh. Right now the entire randomized program is on. On a web gen, just load seed. So technically started in summer 2019. Really old minimal version. Development really picked up in around April 2020. Okay, so yeah, like about a year of like solid development. Nice. Very nice. Very fucking pog. It's it's very well put together for what it is right now. See, but then you have me, right? Where I haven't played this game in a while, and I'm struggling with basic shit. It is a thing? Oh shit, I need to look it up. I'm really curious. I said that I would play randomizers of all the mainline Zelda games, and I, I still want to hold true to that. I cannot pull. Um, so if, if a Skyward Sword randomizer is in development and it's like decently solid, I'll definitely play it. Wait. Wait. <laughs> Wait. Ideas. Ideas are flowing through my brain. Fast transform. Uh, you're talking about like fast wolf transform? Like that? I'm assuming that's what you're talking about. Because if that is what you're talking about, I actually... I, like I said, it's been years since I played Twilight Princess, so I don't remember how fast it was in the old version. But it's it's super speedy. I do love it. In terms of like like removing the wolf sections and stuff too, that's very much appreciated. Wait, R plus Y. R plus Y. What? Wait, you could just do that? You could just You that's just a thing? <laughs> I had no idea that was a thing, and I really love that. That's... That's so much more satisfying. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. That is very, very handy. I appreciate that a lot. It's only like... I would say it's like half a second faster, but it's still faster. So more HD like. I never played the HD version, actually, now that I think about it. Like, I, I know of certain changes in the HD version, like I know that you can choose between the mirrored and the normal version of Twilight, or like the Wii versus GameCube version. I didn't know that that was, that was the thing that they added. That's cool. It's, it's a very nice addition. I appreciate that a lot. Um, what I was talking about with um, skipping the wolf sections too, like the Twilight Wolf sections, that's also very handy. I I think that that's like a big sticking point for a lot of people when they play this game, is like 
the wolf sections, like the twilight sections and the tutorial just take way too fucking long. Press a button on the screen and transform. Oh, like on the bottom screen? That makes sense. Yeah. Th that makes sense that they would add a button like that. Um, but... Oh, I see, I see, I see. I know how to beat, I know how to beat the puzzle. Um, yeah, like, certain parts of the beginning of the game are very, very tedious for people, and I think that turns people away from it a lot. Uh, the ability to remove those, I actually wish was almost its own mod. I don't, I don't know if it is or not, but the way that this randomizer does it is very clean, which I like. Um, all that for 50 rupees, of course. Of course it was. Why would it be anything else? I'm not paying attention while I'm opening up the tracker. There we go. Uh, we're going next down that path. Okay. Um, but yeah, like li little little time improvements like that are very neat. It it might be cool. Well, actually, I don't know if it would be. The ability to randomize the spirit tears. Yeah, GG, right? The ability to randomize the, the Tears of Light and the Spirit Vessel. But, like, still be able to go, like, switch between Twilight and not covering Twilight. I don't even know if that's possible. It's probably not. But, like, it's an idea, I guess, for people who still want to play those parts of the game. Um, is there actually... Hold on, I'm curious. Does the console have an option for skipping? Because I know that it has the ability to skip parts. Yeah. Like, early desert. Uh, no shot bottle. Faster. Yeah, skip intro. And then uh, early... Early Palace of Twilight. Early Temple of Time? Oh, I probably could have enabled those, honestly. Open HC. What is HC? Hidden... no. Uh, uh, Hyrule Castle. Hyrule Castle. Open Hyrule Castle. That's an interesting one. I might have to do another run of this, honestly. Because I want to I wanna play around with the skips. I haven't... I didn't enable any of them, and I kind of regret it. But... Because, like, I thought at first that I'd be able to get into, into uh, the Temple of Time early. It would be hard to shuffle tears. Could be a thing to shuffle vessels. That would be... It'd be interesting as an option. I wouldn't want it to be mandatory, because I think... Like, the big thing removes the barrier. Starting with Rainbow Bridge. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. And then you just have to go around finding the, um... The key items to be able to get through Hyrule Castle. That, that makes sense. I like that. Um... What was I saying? What was I just saying? Right, the ability to, to do dungeons out of order was something I was interested in. Um, I didn't... I realize now that that's my mistake for not realizing that you can have, like, early skips for dungeons. I wish I had known about that ahead of time, but now I have to do more runs where I play around with the, uh... Enabling the skips. Oh no, bug, get back here. Bug, no. Stop it! Just get the fuck off. Oh my god. Oh, come on. There we go. Uh, bug? Also, there's gonna be a Poe around here somewhere. I think it's on the bridge. I'm gonna have to go back for it. Ooh, hey! Nice reward. Give me more money. Fuck. But yeah, I, I tried going to Temple of Time early, and I didn't realize that it was like an option that you had to enable. So I was just like, oh, I don't need the chicken, I can just jump over there with Wolf Link. No, it turns out you need, you need to finish uh, um, Snowhead first, which I did not realize. 
Okay, 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 okay. No, 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 no. I, I, I don't wanna, I don't wanna attach to them. Just, just get them out of the way. Oh, this is really bad. I don't know why I'm using the old method, I just learned about a faster method to turn into a wolf when I'm not using it. Did it again. It's gonna be a force of habit. It's it's muscle memory, right? It's like I'm so used to the old way that I'm gonna forget about the old way or the new way constantly. Head out. Good luck on the run. Hell yeah! Yeah, thank you for stopping by. I'm I'm assuming you're one of the devs, or if not, are on the team. Thank you so much for stopping by. I appreciate it. I've been having a lot of fun with your randomizer, <laughs> so yeah, it's it's been so much fun. Thank you for developing it, and I'm excited for 1.0 as well. I'm gonna be on the lookout for that. Uh, which way is? It's this way. Up the stairs, actually. Is there anything under this rock? I could just look at the tracker, but I'm not going to. Because where's the fun in that? Mm, just money. As well. Muscle memory. I, I really gotta... <laughs> I really gotta learn that new way. I gotta imprint that into my brain. Uh, ooh, interesting. Rocks. Wait, can I blow these up or no? I hope I can. Whoa, whoa. Lots of base on that, okay. Uh, hey, look, that item that we never use? Let's use it. Ready, set, kick, foot. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I am... I am confused, though. Because I jumped way too high, and I'm wondering if I have a uh, speed hack for this thing. I might be fucking it. Oh, never mind. You got it. Yeah. Oh, shit. Okay. Wait, one more time, one more time. E. Tony Hawk Pro Skater 4. Oh. Oh. Damn it. Okay, one more time. There's something, there's something at the end of this. I know there is. Fuck, too early. Always too early. Ah, oh, god. We're gonna get it. We just need to try like 30 more times. I, I did the same thing I did the first time. Why? Yes. Wait, what if I don't press anything? Oh, that actually just works. Okay. I was overthinking it, as I usually do. Oh, uh, oh, uh, fuck. On the other direction. Right, because then I don't get enough height. Oh, yes. Okay, jump. 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 And jump. And jump. Jump. 
Hey, we made it. Tony Hawk, Pro Skater 4. Fucking hug, dude. Uh, when did we get another heart container? I missed that on my tracker. Yeah, we're at 26, technically? Technically 26? What scent do I have right now? Scent of Ilya. Why do I have that right now? Excuse me, is that just a... Is that just a story thing? I think it's just a story thing. I'm gonna hope it's a story thing. Okay. Ba, 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 ba. Grotto. Shellblade chest. I might try for that one more time. Was this one another grotto that were nearby? Uh, yeah, I might go for both of them. Ooh, careful. I need to work. Cool, where is this grotto? I've never been to this grotto before. Uh, somewhere around here? Or is it up on a ledge? Or maybe just around randomly in the middle of the fucking ground. No, I think it's up on the ledge. Also memory again. Uh, try one more time. I already got Golden Boy up here, didn't I? I definitely got Golden Boy from here already. There it is. Oh, hello! Oh! Whoops! Oh. Use their shields against them. Ow! Careful, careful, careful. <laughs> I definitely thought I was gonna do the jump over, but apparently not. <sighs> really? Okay, no more jumps, just go for it. Never mind, one more. Just for flare. Spring water, it's full of nutrients. Uh, uh, okay. Oh, the, the milk was a half, or the half milk was a bottle, but apparently that's not. Okay. I didn't even mark it on my tracker. I'm forgetting a bunch of things. My bad. There we go. What's next? We... Here's, here's a question. There was a statue over here that we moved, right? Did we get the letter from under it or no? I'm actually unsure if we did. Pleasure. Did we get you? Yeah, we got you already. Okay. Never mind, that's not a thing. Not a check that I thought I was gonna get. Underwater chest? Old Poli? Oh, we do have the claw shot. We can get the Lanayru stuff. 
Okay, let's just let's just finish some things to the west. God, it's I've been going late this stream apparently. Okay, I've been having fun. Like I've always said, I really enjoy this game. Oh, oh, there, there you go, Link. Just a little bit of a fancy put away your sword moment. Um, I might turn in. Let me turn in the bugs. Just to get any and all checks possible. And then... Yeah, okay. And then I'll go to the west. Uh, get a couple of things on the Liniru Bridge-ish? Like, right above Lake Hylia. Then move on from here. Fuck, I came here... Oh, I came here as a wolf. God damn it. I always forget. I always forget. Oh, quit your whining. Just a giant wolf walking through the village. Who cares? You stop screaming at me, I won't bite your freaking face off. How about that? check something. There's something on my tracker that I have not looked at at all. One, two, three, four, five, six. Well, turns out I have six skills that I just have not even noticed. <laughs> there we go. I never even noticed that was a thing that I could I could mark. I am shocked that I don't have the slingshot yet. I feel like that would have been an early check. Or maybe not. Maybe the logic allows for it to be basically anywhere. As long as you get, like, the boomerang. <laughs> yes, creep, I did bring some bugs for you. A couple, in fact. Are the are the bug pair rewards the same thing always? Is it always a wooden shield? I guess we'll we'll find out in a second here. Like those always feel like they're a piece of art, the the single ones, and the second ones feel like they're always a wooden shield. So, like, if I'm correct, this one will be a wooden shield. No, it's a postal. Maybe it changes between them? Uh, is that... Is that it? Seven more bugs, yep. Okay! I should, I should really... I promised me I'd meet them in VR chat. Uh, maybe I should... Hold on. Maybe I should at least let them know that it'll be a little bit. Or I might just end stream soon. Who knows what I'm thinking. I don't know what I'm thinking most of the time. I'll, I'll do a couple of checks here, um, or I'll finish up a couple, right? Uh, don't want to be here though. Yeah, I need to go out that exit. Um, oh! <laughs> oh! Fuck, Lunar Soaps, come back, I wanted to ask you about the wooden chest, <laughs> the wooden ch uh, statue check. God damn it, oh well. I literally had a dev in my chat and I could have asked them. Oh well. I'll figure it out, I'm sure. But that'll be for later. I still need to get one more Sky character, and I still need to get the second claw shot, so... Either way, I'm, I'm blocked before I can continue to the next dungeon. Mm -hmm. 
Field first. Mm -hmm. Already got the golden bugs here. I probably should have been marking this. Oh. I wonder, like, Link should definitely be getting tired, right, from running around as a wolf? Or do wolves just not get as tired as quickly as humans do? Like, is that is that a real thing? Oops. Like, I I feel like running miles and miles real quick would tire him out as a human, like almost more. But probably probably shouldn't be doing that. Then again, this guy's a fucking Chad. We already established that. Strong as fuck. Carrying around tons and tons of weapons. God, I am so excited for my COVID shot tomorrow. I, it's weird to say that I'm excited for a shot, right? Like, I'm excited to get poked with a needle. Like, it's the first step. It's the first step towards getting shit done. You're getting shit over with. How am I only two post souls away from fucking finishing all of them? There's only 60, right? Yeah, there's only 60. I'm so confused. Okay, that's done. There's a grotto down south. Okay. <laughs> Oh no, that was it, that was it, that was it. We just got that one. Wait, Grotto? What the fuck? Oh, outside Grotto. There's two chests here. There's one in a Grotto and one out of a Grotto. There it is, that probably should have been obvious. In retrospect. bombs. I want to fill this with the uh, bomblings anyway. Not that the bomblings are useful at all, I just like having them. Oh, that one's just an actual green rupee. Cool, fuck you, game. God, God damn it. Like, fuck off. Okay, running back across the bridge, we're gonna try for that one grotto that was, um... It, 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 it essentially dis- er, not disappeared. It didn't show up for me. It made no sense whatsoever. But I'm gonna try again. Maybe it just unlocked now, somehow, magically. Go 
go and then go as fast as your tiny wolf paws can carry you. will be probably the last few checks. I kind of want to take care of everything that's in the general Lake Hylia area, and then I'll probably call it there. Because it is getting late. Hi. Oh, I'm fabulous. Uh, I know you are. Come here. Okay, we already know that everything else is a bust, so let's go right down. Oh no, Link, why didn't you jump? Link, you idiot. Just fucking jump, it's not hard. I know you didn't technically get that ability until Breath of the Wild, but like, come on. Oh, 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 careful. Don't. This had to head. This had to have been a grotto. And it just wouldn't appear for me. It's. It's here now, I guess. Sure, why not? I was confused as fuck why it was not here. Uh, looks like we got some friends. Get on that. Get on that armor. Uh oh, fucking clams. Oh no. Fucking clams! Just, just take care of the clams. Don't need to use the hookshot on them. So much easier than Ocarina. So much easier. Look at that. Look at how simple that was, Link. Good, I can finally mark this off on my stupid tracker. Nice. Piece of heart? Fuck. I definitely have trouble marking off the heart pieces, like, consistently. I just constantly forget about them. Okay. Done. Uh, am I able to just warp from- no? Nope. Why would I be able to? Why would I be able to warp from inside of a cave? <laughs> well, almost there. In terms of general overworld chests, we're almost there. We have stuff in northern Hy Hyrule, like Thor's Domain kind of area, which we have basically never touched, but we're getting there. Um, okay, now we can warp. Right there. There's a grotto down here. Link's a borfy boy. He's just like borf borf borf, and then he runs and he does the thing. I, I'm going fucking insane. Getting late for me. Uh, no, no grotto around here. Where? Where would it be? Why can't I see it? Maybe this one? No? Oh. 
Definitely thought it was somewhere around here. No. Uh, not here. Oh, get up there. Okay, where? Where? Where is it? There's an underwater chest. Oh, it's like way down, way down south. Grotto Water Toad Poli. Okay. Like way, way down here. That that fast transform is so useful. Uh, like here. Right in the middle of the grass, probably. Yep, there you go. Don't know how I didn't see this. Oh, hello. <laughs> uh, these things need to die very quickly. They're gross. They got like big DSLs, which I'm not a fan of personally. Fuck. actually go fishing in this area if we wanted to. We have we have the ability to fish here and collect actual fish. I haven't done it because fuck that, but like we can do that if we wanted to. Sadness and disappointment. And disappointment is immeasurable. And my day is ruined. Did we... did we howl at this boy yet? Uh, I'm trying to think of where the last howling stone is. Uh, there's one right in front of Hyrule Castle. And I can't for the life of me remember how to get to it. Or how to activate it. Is it this one? No, it's already activated. It's not in the Palace of the Sky, it has to be... Like, Palace of Twilight then, right? I do not remember. That might be something that I have to look up. Get the last, um... Skill from it. It's technically a check, so I'm gonna have to get it. What if? Wait, those. <laughs> you know those uh, green rupees that I keep getting? No, it's not. Never mind. I thought maybe those were skills. Like it just didn't have an in-game model, so like it didn't show it. I, I don't know. A lot of unknowns with this randomizer. It's still in development. Underwater chest. Underwater chest. That is so non-specific. Could literally be anywhere. Literally anywhere. Maybe here? Oh, yep. It's just sitting here. Never have thought to check here. And yet here we are. Yeah, I figured. But now you know what time it is. It's time for me to get two more chests and then I'm answered. I don't I don't want to I don't want to stop playing. I'm not gonna be able to stream tomorrow at all. Probably gonna feel too shitty anyway after the COVID shot. Oh wait, what am I doing? There's there's literally a I could literally just swim towards it. 
In which case I should actually just uh, back on. There we go. I won't stream tomorrow. Probably the next time I stream is going to be uh, the Ocarina Multi. Oh, are there Pose? I have not... Fuck, there is. Okay. Uh, okay. Let me... Actually, you know what? It might be faster to swim as a wolf. Is it? Let's test this. Uh, yeah, it kind of is, actually. Gotta keep that in mind. I have not been keeping track of the golden bug locations at all, so that is one thing that I'm going to need to do for future reference. Get down here, you bitch. Your name was Jonathan. Jonathan Third. You died from inhaling too much alcohol. Hey, hey, okay. That's a pretty good way to end stream. That should be the last one. Right? I hope. Oh, I hope it's the last one. Filled. Yes. Okay, that's the last one. Ah, okay. I'm glad. I'm glad I went to go get that. Oh boy. Um. We have one piece of the puzzle to getting to City in the Sky. I think. It might still make us do the story stuff. It might still make us um, get Ilya's charm and everything. I'm not sure. Maybe I can get these really quick and then I'll go try that. I'll just I'll just end stream in Kakariko in the house where the uh, where I need to deliver that. If only I knew where to claw shot onto. Somewhere around here. Somewhere around here. How do I even get up there? One does not simply. One does not simply claw shot their way up there. That is way too high. Don't tell me I need to fucking float down with a chicken. Don't do that to me. Don't. Don't make me do that. I don't think I could even reach this if I wanted to. It's really gonna make me do it. It's really gonna make me do it. It's gonna make me go all the way back up, float down on a stupid chicken. <sighs> You're supposed to be able to claw shot these things, and I just don't. Yeah, that's way too fucking high up. Just on that. Uh, this game. Okay. It's okay. It's just one frustrating chest. Two, technically, but they're in the same spot. Just oh no, I have to pay twenty more dollars. Uh, let's see if I can get a horse this time. That'd be pretty neat. Hey, I hope I can. I actually don't see any horse grass anywhere. Uh, horses might be out of the question here. Yeah, I think they are. Okay. That's fine. It's not that much faster. Hmm. You know, I wish, I wish VTubing software had, like, hotkeys that you could press that would play a set animation. Because then, whenever I take a drink of water, I could literally just press a button on my keyboard and drink that water on stream. That'd be neat. It's actually really... I feel like a lot could be done with that. I, I'd love to see that. Because I could switch scenes, but... Eh... 
Like, that's a lot of work setting up that animation. <laughs> I'd have to set it up as a video file and push the scene and play the GIF and yeah. And yes, I do say GIF. I say GIF like gift. It's the only way to pronounce it. If you want to unfollow me because I say it weird? Go ahead. Uh, give me. And jump. You know, I actually. Oh! Wait a fucking second, the cannon's just there! It's just. The cannon's just fucking there. They already built it for us. Great, okay. So we get to skip all that. all that cutscene stuff. Ooh. Wait, 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 slow down, slow down, slow down, fuck. Uh, 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 okay. Okay, we got one. One more to find, cool. I hope this works the way that I hope this works. Uh, 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 uh. And I will remember to put that heart piece in the fucking tracker in a second. Rupees, okay. Our piece, nice. That's these two done. Left statue chest, right statue chest, underwater chest. Cool, there's some random side quest shit. Uh, yeah. Okay. You need what you need. Last thing I want to do, we can't go to the City in the Sky yet. We don't have the double claw shot, and I don't want to... I don't want to dip into dungeons if I don't have to. So, we're going to go around the rest of Hyrule searching for the last claw shot, and then I think... I think we're good to beat the game. We just need to speed around the rest of the dungeons, basically. So, yeah. I think that's kind of on the agenda. Do they have a person watching out? Oh, there's a Poe up there! Fuck me and my completionist attitude. I want to go get it. I might, you know what, since I'm here, I'm gonna check this first. It's already 11 o'clock, god damn it. Hey, yeah, you good? You good? Everyone in here good? Do I need to talk to you? No, it's just we're gonna skip that part of your quest. I guess we don't need to, technically. <laughs> like, not unless we find the wooden statue somewhere. Yeah, this. This needs to be moved, by the way. Is this...? Nice. So the idea of getting all those characters in the book was that... What the fuck? Never mind, I thought that was an animal, it's just pottery. Um... The idea of getting all those characters in the book was that it can unlock this thing. No, you're fine. Yeah. It, it unlocks that statue so that we can move it out of the way so we can get into here. Oh, hello. Wait, do you actually want me to do this? Because it's already there. Well, let's try. Warp. Yeah, warp back to... Warp it to Lake Hylia. Apparently we can just do the cutscene. I hope this doesn't break anything. Because the cannon's already there, but... Okay. We can just tell the game that we did this, I guess. Okay, yeah, it's just gonna it's gonna skip that whole ordeal. So we claw shot in there, we get to the city of the sky, and we're good to go. Um now we need to walk all the way back to Kakariko.
I might clean up my tracker a little bit because I, I don't know where to get the golden bugs or the pose. Those might still be on our to-do list for finding the uh, second claw shot. Ooh, 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 careful. Uh, I do just want to get this pose, and there's also a shop down here, I think. Why the fuck are there enemies? Oh, it's the crows, that's right. Buy something, buy something. Yeah, sure. What do you got? Hey! Another piece of heart. Another potion. What are you? Another piece of heart. Yeah, the, uh, the in-game models and the descriptions for the shop items do need to be changed. That would be very, very handy. Okay. Nice. Um, did I put that on my tracker? Uh, it doesn't appear on the tracker, so I'm gonna assume it's fine. What is my what is my scent right now? I have scent of Ilya. Why did it switch to the youth scent? I don't understand. I'm Confucian. Why, if this is Kansas, this is not uh, Kansas? Which is a good question. If you've ever seen that video, the woman actually asks a very valid question. If Kansas is Kansas, why is Arkansas not Arkansas? I, 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 I don't understand it myself. Hey, nice. Yeah, let's get some uh, bomblings. Whoops. Uh, oh, you're just actually a bomb shop. Cool. Might as well fill up. Yeah, let's get five more of those. Hey, we're open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Let's know that the, the world of Hyrule works in the same, like, moon cycle. Da, 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 da. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Oh, there's a poke here, too. Ah, oh, shit. No, no, no. I, I keep pressing all the wrong buttons. Get down here, you bitch. Your name is Ronaldo. And you committed crimes for being too handsome and had to be executed. Ooh, bombs. That's a... That's like one of the very few times I've actually seen a bomb reward. No. And you I have to be really careful with this guy. Okay. Good. Your name was Lorenzo. You were also punished for being too handsome. Okay. Uh, there is... Let me just check one thing really quick. There is a thing for a Watchtower alcove, but I think for the most part, we're done with our checks. Like, done, done, pretty much. So, uh, next time... Alcove. Wait, this is not an alcove. Didn't we come up here already? I don't remember. Uh, well, there's one chest, but that's that's the watchtower chest, is it not? Uh, oops. Oops. I thought that was a thing. Apparently you can climb into here as a wolf. I think that's because there's a bug here in the twilight. Or when this place is covered in twilight. Nice. Okay. Uh, well, if there's nothing at the top here, I guess that will be pretty much the end of the stream. So stick around if you're here. I actually don't know how many of you are here. Let me check. Pull up this. Okay. 
Elk. Oh, what's this down here? Oh, there is a chest. Oh, I didn't even know that that existed. Shit. Okay. How do I get to it? How? Oh, I, I need to bring up a chicken, don't I? Well, let's kill ourselves. Amazing. I want to get this one. I want. I want. I want to get it. I want to get it. Fuck. I'm here, you, you bitch of a chicken. Okay, there we go. Wait, how do I get back to the top then? Why are the chickens up there? You know what? I'll save it for next time. For now, I think that's going to do it. Um. Thank you, everybody, who stopped by. I, I really do appreciate it, even if you stop by only for a little bit. Um, yeah, I've been having a lot of fun with this randomizer. Like, a lot, a lot of fun. So, next time, if things go smoothly, if we find the second claw shot quickly, uh, we should maybe be able to beat the game. Because that's the only major item that we're missing, so... Yeah... I, I, I think we can beat the game next time, hopefully. So, thank you everybody who joined me on this journey. If you did, um, I think what I'm going to do is I don't really have anybody to raid, so I'm just going to end right there. Uh, yeah, I don't really have... Nobody's really online right now, so... I'm going to end stream. Um, thank you for stopping by, and uh, Ocarina Rando Sunday. And final part of this one, either sometime between then or immediately after the Ocarina multiplayer. So, yeah. Okay. Bye. Thank you for stopping by. I appreciate it. Bye.